it was fine. Team scores. Yeah, like I said, I don't know what they did. Like, some update on one piece of software or the other just completely killed the ability to stream VR games. I don't know why. Until you started talking about it being fine. <laughs> Got him. Um, Sounds about right. Oh no, I jinxed it. And we are back. So very different than in the past. Yeah, I really don't know what happened. I might just have to gut my computer and reinstall Windows from scratch and start all over again. I don't know if it's something on my computer that was updated or if they updated the back end of how the VR games work and it completely destroyed its ability to be streamed or what happened, but it used to work so well when I first got the VR headset. It's really frustrating, honestly, because I would love to play more VR, but if it's not gonna work, there's no sense in playing it. He's trying to no-scope me, he failed. Run, run. Oh gosh, that's you. Don't do that to me. Run, run, we're gonna get it, we're gonna get it, we're gonna get it. Weird. It is really weird, I have no idea what happened. Like, this past week, and I took like four days off of work last week, and like, that's all I did during the day on all four of those days, is just try to troubleshoot this and figure out what's wrong with it. And the only thing I can think of is, like, for some reason now, and it didn't used to be like this, but some reason now when I play VR, like, as soon as I play VR and open OBS at the same time, my processor on my computer just skyrockets up to, like, 100% usage every time. And I don't know why. I don't know if, like, I'm not investing any more money into this computer. Like, the computer's more than powerful enough to handle it. So I'm not going to sit here and, like, update my piece of CPU when it's not the CPU. That's the problem. It's something about the software, I'm assuming. Oh, he got me. He got me. Scored again. We're so good. Where's our flag at, guys? What the world is that? Hey, who shoot me? Oh, you got me. I... Holy... <laughs> Someone's grunting in my ear. Oh, he's so, he's so quick. Almost got him, almost got him. But sorry about the technical difficulties. Hopefully it wasn't too uh, annoying. It was extremely annoying to me. But this game seems to be playing all right so far. And now watch as soon as I said that it's gonna disconnect. No. Oh, did I get you? I got him. Good game, good game. Good game. No worries. I would really love to be able to play Half-Life Alex again. Like, I played it when it first came out. I played Half-Life Alex all the way through on Twitch, streaming it, and it worked perfectly fine. So it's extremely annoying. Yeah, get the sniper! Death from above, rain death! I got him. No gun! No, you always... I know, I always. You're done. No, he, oh, I would have gotten him with the grenade, though. Got, we gotta get one more point, guys. Come on. We gotta win this. We gotta bring it home. What is the point right now? Where's the scoreboard? I don't know where the... Oh, there. I was gonna say, I don't know where the gigantic scoreboard is on this level. Okay, we're in, we're in the lead. You just gotta maintain that. We're good to go. No, get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get them all. Get them all. They're all like little ants. They're just scurrying everywhere. Get him! Get him! Get him! Oh my gosh! I'm being surrounded! No! No! No, hide behind the rock! Get this guy! Get him! Aw, oh, come on, you're moving around too much. 
I wonder if you could rent a PC for a week just to stream a VR game. You might have to look into that, actually. See if, like, something is actually wrong with my PC or if it actually is a software update they did that just completely made it incompatible. Because that's the problem with, like, testing your computers. Unless you know somebody else can do something you're trying to do, you don't know if it's your computer or not. So, like, you can sit there and troubleshoot your own computer forever and sit there and tweak it and do different software configurations. But until you actually get a chance to, like, try it with a completely different computer that you know works. And then say, oh, well, obviously something's jacked up with my computer. Science! Yeah, all part of the scientific method. But then my biggest concern is if it does end up being my computer, what is the solution? <laughs> Besides just completely wiping my computer and starting over. Stay still, you. Stay still and let me shoot you. Got him. No! No! No, 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 no. Stop moving. You're so wily. Oh, you got me. Oh, man. Get out of here with that weak sauce. Got him. Told him his sauce was weak. You guys heard that? I told him he was, his Help! sauce was weak. <laughs> no! Oh, Every no time. Way. Give me that. They're dead. They're dead to me. Every one of them. Stop moving. Why are you moving around so much? Don't you know I'm trying to shoot you? Oh, they got me. Where's the sauce? It's weak. I didn't even want it. I left it behind, so it's so weak. No, 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 Scared me. Bubby is the sauce boss. I am. I tell you whether your sauce is strong or weak. Your sauce. Your sauce very strong. He doesn't seem to care. Oh, no. Stop moving around so much. One minute remaining. Someone's going after our flag, man. Surprise. No, your sauce is weak, your sauce is weak! Oh, it was, it was weak. No, 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 no. How did he get me? I had no idea where I was on the map. I thought I was still at my base. So yeah, this is Rec Room, guys. This is just one of the games you can play in Rec Room, but it's a free game, free to play. You can play it in VR, or you can just get it on the regular computer or console now. It's actually out on PlayStation and Xbox now. I believe. I know it came out on PlayStation first, but I'm pretty sure it's out on PlayStation now. I just wanted to get one sniper shot before the end of the match. You Come win. on. Come on. Why'd you move? When you see I'm me pick late. up a sniper, you're supposed to stay I'm still. Hey guys, uh, I might have to leave, bro. Alright, I'm gonna I'm, I'm to gonna have to get off. Ma, I wanna play some All right, bro. Uh, laser tag and uh, Why laser tag? Why every time laser tag? I gotta get off anyway, so... Alright, bros. Hey, you guys are real bros tonight, alright? I wanna go play... You were real bros, alright? Wow. Actually, no, not tomorrow, not tomorrow. I got 22 You too, man. You were the best bro of them all. Looks like Roblox. These kids sound so young. Yeah, but they're bros, dude. Like, you can't deny a bro. Bro recognizes bro, alright? Doesn't matter if they're three, four, five, six, seven. If they're a bro, they're a bro. Can't, cannot deny it. Rose for life. 
Ready to start. Live free or die hard, bros. You know what I'm saying? Live free or die hard. No, please, no. We're doing this the OG way. Why is it that everyone likes this map? Pog. <laughs> Pog it up, bud. Game on. Hi. Let's get a dub. Capture the flag. Let's get that dub. Let's get that wubble of a dub dub! This is my least favorite map too. I, it is pretty hard, I'm not gonna lie. Especially when you're on this side of the map. You're at like a severe disadvantage, I feel like. Like that, I get shot. No, well, he was behind me, of course. Of course he was. I guard my flag. Who is it? Who's there? We have an infiltrator. Charge! I was recalibrating, sorry. Oh, it's all of a sudden you just... Oh, beloved. Dub dub! In his language, that actually means a call for help. He is in pain. Um, I mean, drop the gun, I guess? Uh, nobody move! Stay away from me! I'm crazy, I'll do it! I'll do it! Oh, that's my guy. Nobody get near me! I'll pull the pin on this bad boy faster than you can say don't pull the pin on that bad boy. Get it, duck! Nailed it. I need a gun. Anybody have a gun? I need a gun. You shot an unarmed man! I thought you had a weapon. Sure he did. Sure. Like it matters. <laughs> Who in like a first person shooter game would actually just not shoot somebody because they don't have a gun? I always forget what team I'm on. I always have to look at the color of my gun or the color of my wristband constantly throughout the match. We hide up here, and we strike in the dead of the night. Who's here? Who's coming? Who wants some? That's a game I'd like to see, the one with Grover or the Zoom one. Oh god, you scared the crud out of me. The game, the one with Grover or the Zoo one, which one's that? Like a VR game? Oh, you mean Trover? Yeah, <laughs> Trover? Trover's pretty fun. Yeah, a shooter. Grover. That would be funny if his name was Grover. The zoo one. Zoo one. I'm trying to think of what zoo game it would be. Zoo one. Yo, what? Mafia That's boss? what. Dang, bro. You just got... You just got got by one of my OGs, son. I'm, I'm trying to hide in the corner while I read chat. Uh, there's shots coming from every direction. I'm so scared. Oh my god, good thing he's as bad of a shot as I am. Whoop, never mind. Apparently he's not. Yeah, Trover. Trover is not a family-friendly stream game, no. But then again, none of my streams are ever labeled family-friendly, so... Because I do have a tendency of slipping a bad word in every once in a while, depending on how many times I die. No. Look at his moves, look at his moves. He's got cat-like reflexes. <laughs> oh, I was wrong. It's Accounting Plus. You got Trover confused with Accounting Plus. Both of them are made by the same people. Trover, in my opinion, is much funnier than Accounting Plus. I have both. So, if I can actually pinpoint why my stream keeps crashing when I try to stream VR games, I'd be more than happy to play either one of them.
No, I was gonna shoot your partner, man. That's rude, bro. Accounting. You do realize though, Accounting Plus is only like a four minute long game, right? <laughs> I think I could beat that whole game in like a half hour. Look over there. Look over there. There's a red guy up there, but he's already dead. Okay, they took care of him. Red guys, red guys. Who's got the right? There's one coming from up there. Oh, I shot him right. Oh, come on. Oh, he's already dead. No, he's already dead. <laughs> I was going to say, I just shot him like three times. Oh, no. He's already dead. I'm gonna get one. I'm gonna get a sniper shot eventually. You wait, you wait for it. It's gonna be the sweetest shot you've ever seen. Ready? Someone's coming down this hallway. <gasps> I don't know if she died. Where's somebody right there just now? I'm scared, I'm all alone, and I'm scared. I'm alone on base and I'm scared, everybody. No, I'm never gonna get a sniper shot. Bubby, what other games are you currently in the middle of playing? Um, Luigi's Mansion, which I think is almost done. Then I started Mario 64 last Friday. And Breath of the Wild. Yippee, hide. Wait for someone to come steal the flag and then we'll get them. <laughs> We'll get them all right. I don't like sitting still, it's boring. Um, is anybody still playing? The map seems awfully empty. <laughs> Oh god! Someone's still playing! I missed! Son of a gun duck! Ugh. Yeah! No! Yikes! Oh, Breath of the Wild, I forgot about that one. Is the progress on that one saved on your PC? Um. Yes? <laughs> I don't know whether to be forthcoming about that or not, but yes. Can you answer that ethically or legally? <laughs> uh, somehow nobody's seen me yet. Oh, eat it, eat it, eat it. Yeah, you better run. Oh yeah, trapped him. He had to run towards me. Got him. Nice. I don't know. I was just trying to echo the sound he made. Try to speak to him in his language. Hello there. Hey, Kodo, the last gamer. How's it going? Oh, no. Oh, stop reading chat. Oh, I didn't even know why I shot at him, because now I gave away my position. They were all walking the other way. Where'd he go? He's so small. He's hard to find. Oh, man. Good. Questionable. <laughs> just wondering. Kodo, do you play Rec Room? Are you a Rec Room fan? Nailed it. We can get him, we can get him, it's two against one. Aww. Yeah, I play Rec Room, what do you play on? You saw that. Man, people are dropping in and out of this game like crazy. Like anytime anybody logs in or out of the game, it like hiccups a little bit. Has anybody even made a point yet? I don't think so. Where's the scoreboard on this level? Where's the giant score? There it is. Oh, we have a point. We're gonna win. Wow, how did I miss you? Good job. Good shot. Good shot, bud. That's an OG. Scream PC. Go get the flag. I should. I'm trying. What is it like playing it on regular screen on the PC? Is it like hard to control? Because I know I've played with some people online on the PC 
and like they don't know how to do like the fist bump or the thumbs up. I have a feeling it's got to have like a billion different buttons for each one of those shortcuts. One button for each hand configuration or something. Got him. No, no, don't, don't let him live. Where'd he go? 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 Turn around. Get him. Oh, he was looking for me too. Not really. It's easier to create though. Oh, I bet. Yeah, being able to like drag and drop stuff with the mouse. I'm sure it is. Would anybody like to play? Snowball, would you like to play? Friday. Hey, everybody else got gifts. Back. What the I heck, didn't, man? I probably didn't. It's because I didn't have this suit on. It's I'll fun. be back. I, I, don't even, I don't even want a gift. It's just real lame. Everybody else got one. And I'm just sitting here without a gift. It's just twiddling my thumbs, you know? It's, it's fine. Don't worry about it. It's, it's fine, guys. It's fine, you know? I hope all your gifts are really cool, though. Hope, I hope they... Hope they were really cool gifts. Guys. Want to see my dorm? I don't even know what you can do with the dorm. I haven't done anything with mine. Like, literally, it's the most empty dorm you've ever seen. You and Bubby can see my dorm. Look, like, it's completely empty. Oh, now I got a gift! Oh, nice! Congrats on getting to level 21! Oh yeah, what did I get? <gasps> what the heck is that? I don't even know. What is it? If I slap it on myself, what does it do? Didn't do anything. I see no difference. I don't even know what the heck that was. Hi. I won, I won these guys. I won these. I, I worked hard for them. What is your user? It should be Bubby Ruski. Bubby Ruski. Did you see it? Did you guys see it right there? Bubby Ruski. I want it. I want that gun. This is all user created stuff here, I guess. Like pictures. Since your friend requests you want to become friend, sure, Kodo. Sounds good to me. <gasps> Just we'll check it out. All right, mom, I better go, but I'll talk to you soon. Take what? Care, okay? Among Us in Rec Room? All right, kisses. Oh, bye. I'll have to check it out sometime. Bye. Bye, okay, bye-bye. Okay, bye. 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 Okay, bye. Bye. We the riders welcome all thrill seekers to the Republic. Hi. Hello. Hello. Crazy baby. So, real quick. Ah! I want you. The door closed. I know. No. The doors are odd. All right. Welcome back to another video. No. Today we'll be doing another Here. room. Uh, follow me. RR. So this room is really amazing. Uh, real quick, <laughs> stand on that <laughs> welcome game. mat over there. Well. What is? Hold on. Something's right playing here. on my desktop. I think. Of, uh, Among Us. It is a great transition to this room. So I hope you guys enjoy it. And of course. I'll be getting my Baja colors, guys. Nah, I'm playing a YouTube you video about. What the heck? I didn't ask you to do uh, that. Quit it. Oh, you have virtual desktop. Yeah, I had a uh, uh, Among Us YouTube video uh, playing in the background. <laughs> so stand here. So, welcome. Stand right there and just wait there. I feel welcome. Don't mind the door closing on you. Oh, I don't mind at all. Okay. I mean. You'll see that I am completely harmless and unarmed. And you have been scanned. I got I, 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 there I we go, there we doors. go. I've never actually so created anything. This is how I scan. scanned you. This is how I scanned you. I first hit button and then hit scan button. Easy. Gotcha. Two steps. And then, after that, I open door. Gotcha. Right here is a slow turning. I just wanted to add that for decoration. Cool, it looks like an Xbox Series X. Kinda. 
But if we go up here, here's where the magic happens. I didn't even know you could, like, build in your dorm. I thought it was, like, an uneditable area. No, you can edit your dorm free as you want. So. This is the magic. You might be wondering what this text here is for. Use that lever. We're gonna empty the trash. We're taking out the trash. And then look at the trash. Look. Oh. Sweet. And then look over here. Look at the little panel. Use the knob to reset. And knob. then use that knob, and it resets. This button here acts as a power switch. It basically turned it off. You can't do anything to the livers or to the knob. You can't do anything gotcha. unless it fits turned back off. Pretty cool. Also, all right, all right, all right. I made it to where when you hit the lever, it goes into a state where it counts from three to zero, and then it takes out the trash. Gotcha. And then use knob, and then it's back to normal. Yeah, I've never actually done any of the building in this game, so I have no idea how it even works. If you want, I can give your dorm a makeover. No, I think we're about to go get ready to play some games here in a second. Looks like you dropped a picture. Yeah. That was one of my friend's pictures. There you go, now you started a photo, a photo wall. Online now? Alright, 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 alright. Well, me and Snowball are gonna go play some games. You're welcome to join if you want. Uh, alright. It's up to you. Alright. I, I think we have Actually, to, we have to like, fist bump. There's a called Party Up. Yep, there you go, there yeah. you go. Now we're gonna play... Honestly, I think my dorm... At least the trash part has to be advanced. Not the most, but it's definitely advanced from anything I done. Sweet. Sweet people. Except for the four speed fan that was in my old version of my dorm. So I invited Snowball, so hopefully she'll show up here. If not, we'll just start a game and then invite her. Ah, oh, I fell. Yeah. She might be coming. Let's uh, see. Sadly, I can't do Among Us Rec Room. Why sadly. is that? Uh, you need VR to play it. And, oh, um, okay. Gotcha. I'm not on VR. I I'm didn't even screen. know it was out already. I thought it was, like, coming out. Um, just click the next button here, and eventually it'll show with Among Us. I'm gonna just try that out. Well, I think Snowball and I might try Among Us out, but if we play uh, uh, Capture the Flag or anything later, we'll invite you. We could try a quest. Uh, like a golden trophy or... um. I'll see what she wants to do. Let's see. I don't know where she is. I invited her. Oh. Storm. Oh, she's she outside. Just joined. Hello! Can you hear me? Yeah. Hey, Snowflake. Also, uh, since I'm on PC, ah! oh. um, I have the magical ability of voice mo- oh, come on. Oh, it changed. Voice what? Okay. Um, let me re-say that again. I oh. have the power of voice- voice mod. Ooh. That's pretty cool. All right, all right, Except, all right. I know you don't want your stuff to be- Copyrighted, so I'm not gonna play any of my soundboard stuff. Appreciate it. That's fair. Yeah. Because I can always turn that off. And besides, I don't know why I have this, but I have big and chunky on my soundboard. <laughs> no, literally. <laughs> and now I'm replacing it with the distraction dance. I think, uh... Gonna play for a 
tiny little bit. I think Wait. we're gonna try and check out that uh that rec room game real quick. Which rec room? Game? All right, that's fine. Or the uh the Among Us the Among Us game. Yes. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Sadly, I can't play because um Screen Boy here can't play VR games and rec and Among Us rec room requires VR. And I have to really? go anyway, so... Huh. Well, thanks for showing us your dorm. Yeah. And Koto is out of here. I got the... I'm gonna check out this. Okay. Sure. See what this is all about. Let's see what this... See what this first person among us is all about. All right. Is she here? Did she come? Find Hello. the imposter and vote them off. You're the imposter, Hello. aren't you? Hello. 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 This is a very social game, so I'm just using a microphone. Explore the first map to scale out and learn how to play. Then, uh, goodbye, my friend. All right, imposter. Put the blame on others. Convince other players that you are not the imposter. I think we're. I think we're familiar follow the line for all the task locations so there's a task oh over here gosh. I bet it's terrifying it probably is we're about to find out apparently they also have a version of this on another VR game called VR chat and I've watched videos of both and the one that's on VR that? chat is like way better but this one is still pretty decent um, oh gosh, this is awesome. I don't know how do you start huh. Cool. Says, head this way to start. This way. This way. This lobby is public. You can join a game, host a game. If this lobby is private, you can create a private game. Uh -huh. Touch buttons to interact. This buttons. Lobby. Oh, wait. Do you want to invite your party to go with you? Is this yellow no. thing on the floor supposed to indicate I have a task? What happened? No. It's the thing I don't like about Rec Room is it's very, very difficult to... Interact with username user made rooms because they can make the buttons very obvious or they can make the buttons very hard to find Is this it? <gasps> this is it Are we spectating? We must be spectating right now I know where Snowball went. I don't know if she's here or not. Where are you, Snowball? So very high. Oh, were you up there too? I didn't see you. It's like very, I don't want to call it user unfriendly, but this game definitely takes some uh, fiddling around with to get games working. I'm Is she in here? Feels weird. Join a game, host a game. How do I do this? Join a game. I guess you just touch the screens, the words, and it like starts a game. I don't know. It's just an empty void. You want to press this again? I don't know how to double. I like it. You have to do it really <laughs> fast. You have to go. I don't know. I don't get it. What? Sure, I'll, I'll become friends. Why not? All right, you know what? We're gonna play something I know how to play because I don't I don't know what the heck's going on here. <laughs> it's not doing anything. All right, paintball.
I gotta download VR chat one of these days so I can try it on there because I've seen the one that's on VR chat and it's way better. I mean, obviously we didn't really get to see this one, but it's really better. Um, okay. Why is it we're not at a party anymore? What's going on? Party up. Yes. What is going on? I'm coming just a sec. Oh. I was trying to go to you, except the game just wouldn't respond. No, 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 no. Oh, two shots on the face. That's nice. Yeah, that was a good shot. Good shot. over there. What the heck was that? No! Ignore my invite, just invite me when you start a new game. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Start a new game, invite Snowball. We're gonna try and get this working. We're gonna try and get this working. No, stop inviting me to things. Ah, I don't know if my game's bored or what's going on. Man, nothing's working in item VR. It's actually really disappointing. Good thing it's a test stream because uh, <laughs> it's not going very well. Party up, yes. I don't know. Yes, please. My goodness. Not very user friendly. It's a free game, so you gotta. Yeah, the game, like, I don't know. Just wasn't responding to anything I was doing. <laughs> Seems like par for the course, I guess. Um, I don't oh, know. Gosh. <laughs> Paintball, whatever you want to play, we can play. I didn't really, I couldn't figure out how to get that Among Us game to start. Like, we were just floating up in the sky forever. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if you have to, like, wait until the right timing or whatever, but yeah, it wasn't clear. We can figure it out another time. Yeah. So we can do whatever. Somebody like keeps inviting me. No, I don't even know who that is. Um. So yeah, we can uh, do paintball. We can do fr ooh. We can do frisbee golf. Ooh. Are you the you party one. leader? Works for me. Am I? How? Do, like? Uh, what do I, I have I do? no idea. Oh, I. I it's very. You. I mean, I guess we can just do a fist bump. Oh, are we a party yet? No. No fist bump. There we go. Now we can go. Can you start it, or do you want me to? I can. Which is very, like, that's one of the things about this game. The user interface could use a lot of, uh, a lot of work. I think. Frisbee golf? Yeah, frisbee golf, Cody. Oh yeah. Ready to start. Trying to think like what other VR games I have downloaded right now. I don't think I actually have any other ones downloaded right now because I was thinking after a while we could try a different game. But I don't think I actually have any other VR games installed on my computer currently. So that Whoa. will destroy your Hello. frisbee. Hello. No good. Wait. Oh. That Hello. Hey, will you block your frisbee. Hello. No Hello. good. Hello. Hello. Finally, I can join. 
And this will blow your frisbee away. No good. <laughs> maybe more Breath of the Wild? Maybe. Because this, this keeps my interest for a while, but not too long. I'm not going to lie. I think I'm stuck. Damn, my game doesn't... I think I'm stuck. Press the stop button. Are we waiting for another player? No, it's not blowing. No, we can go. Okay. Boop. Yeah. Maybe more Breath of the Wild. Yeah, I guess I did skip yesterday's stream, so that is the day I typically play Breath of the Wild. Game so we'll play this for about 20 minutes, 30 minutes, and then maybe we'll play some Breath of the Wild. You know, a game that I know my computer actually runs on stream, yeah. This game seems to be working on stream pretty decently. No, no. I feel like he's had good luck with uh, frisbee golf. Yeah. It's like the one game that consistently streams without any hiccups. Yeah. Whoa, it's launching. You can do it, guys. I believe in you. Oh, so close. Oh, really? So close. Gotta give him the moral support, you know? Oh, you were right there. I'm right there. Why didn't you knock it in? It moved. Come on. Oh. Stop moving! It's it's moving. I'm trying to get the highest score possible on this hole. Seems like you're doing a pretty good job. Thank you. That's five. That was pretty good. Feeling good about it. <laughs> I don't even know where the other player went. <laughs> Their first be like <laughs> launched out that way, and then they just disappeared into the distance someplace. We have to wait. Yep, we have to wait. Yeah. Cool. It's all good. They're way over there. Okay. That Breath of the Wild is your culprit for all of your problems. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Breath of the Wild could very well be the culprit for all of my problems. <laughs> Because it's I mean, the only thing I've really changed on my computer since the last time I streamed VR games. And for all I know, it could have yeah. some sort of virus or spam or something on it. I don't think it's a virus or spam. I think it just modified your PC somehow in a way that was not optimal. I don't know what to do. Possibly. Oh. So maybe we just rush through Breath of the Wild in the next couple of weeks and then we try VR streaming after I clean install Windows. I do hope you go back to VR streaming though. Oh, I'm trying. Like, that's what I'm trying to do right now is to try to get it working. And I thought Half-Life Alex was going to work because I recorded for like an hour on it earlier. Did you see that, bro? And that it worked amazing. just fine. <laughs> amazing. It didn't go in. Oh. <laughs> got her. Oh. You thanks, got smack. Thanks you got smack talked. <laughs> this is my favorite hole. Here we go, make it launch. Oh, is this the oh I messed up. Oh, I didn't mess up. It caught it. Barely. That sucked. Maybe try clearing CMOS. Oh, oh, what is CMOS? <laughs> That's like the BIOS memory, right? Cannonball! Ooh. That actually gets your gut going. Like, it feels like you're actually How falling from a high spot. Here? Weak ass throw. Uh, because my sauce was weak. <laughs> Weak sauce. Oh, like that? Yeah. Oh, look at it go. It's out of here. It's way past the goal. It was such a good throw. Yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> I need to stop lifting those weights. Oh, man. Can't play frisbee golf. I'm throwing it way too hard. Try clearing CMOS. You know, I need to do that anyhow, because uh, I was in there, like, overclocking my CPU recently because I saw that VR was making the CPU use like 100% of it. So I overclocked my CPU and then the VR CPU percentage dropped. 
and I was hoping it gave it enough overhead to run OBS and VR at the same time, but it appears that's not the case, <laughs> judging by tonight's experience. But um, yeah, I've been meaning to reset it anyway, because when I was in there, I shut off legacy USB support. And what that does is it actually makes it so you can't use your input devices that are plugged into USB on your BIOS screen. So I went into the BIOS to adjust the overclock setting after I did that. And then I was like, oh, uh, apparently I can't make any ch changes in BIOS anymore because I screwed myself. You're doing like yoga poses over there? I'm trying to get my exercise. No, I can't. Bend down and touch your toes. Bend down and touch your toes. How much RAM do I have? I have 16 gigs. I've done a lot of Google searching about this particular issue for weeks now. And some people swear up and down that upgrading your RAM to like 32 gigs makes a substantial difference in VR performance. And other people swear that it does absolutely nothing. <laughs> and they've upgraded their v uh, RAM all the way up to 64 gigs and literally seen no performance improvements whatsoever. So I'm like, I don't know who to believe. Like one half of the one side of the argument says it's definitely the problem and I need to upgrade it and then the other side is like no don't waste your money like I did it did nothing I'm like okay well because I was literally at a point where I was just giving up and I was like at this point I'm just going to gut my machine and like upgrade all of the pieces one by one starting with more RAM and then a higher level CPU but then I thought about it and I was like no I knew it worked at some point so it has to be software related and I'm not going to dish $300 into my computer or 400 more than that to upgrade pieces that might not need to be upgraded. This is the worst Can hole, by the way. Ball. Mercy no ball coming up right here. Oh no! Yeah. Oh, I thought it was gonna blow it right in. So a big is it DDR4? Yeah, it's DDR4 2400, I think. If that's a thing. <laughs> <laughs> An update could bog the system. Oh, it's terrible. What? This hole is the worst one. Is the worst one by far. Mercy roll. No. I was trying to catch it. <laughs> no. <laughs> so I've heard like a lot of people say the problem is trying to run Steam VR on an oculus headset because what happens is oculus has their own software that has to run to make the system work and then layered on top of the oculus software you're running steam vr's software which is apparently extremely intensive on your system more so than the oculus software is but as of now there's no way possible to shut one or the other off like you literally have to run both <laughs> operating systems on top of each other in order to get it working which seems like a huge oversight when they made it but and i think that's the main problem is like when you use both because if i play just the oculus oh. game like i'm doing now like this game is on oculus it's not on steam it seems to run pretty well but as soon as i start trying to play a steam vr game it's like horrible like it just bogs the whole system down and i've heard like the only way to improve it is to get like a massively overpowered cpu and I'm not about to spend $500 on a new CPU just to make VR work a little better on on Twitch. Does it max your CPU? Yeah, when you open the control panel, like I never did this before when it was working fine because I used to stream on Twitch just fine on VR and it worked perfectly. But I never actually checked my CPU usage back then. But now when I play like a Steam VR, C uh, VR game and I open the control, I didn't actually see it. I was looking... Um, when I play a Steam VR game on my computer and I open the control panel, like the CPU usage is skyrocketed, like 98, 99%. So I don't know if it's like a virus or a spam that I have on my computer that's like resource heavy that's just hogging my CPU, or why it would suddenly use all of my CPU now before it, when it didn't before, obviously, because it used to run just fine. It's like while I'm cubby. while I'm streaming, I'm doing like troubleshooting with chat. I I'll put a link in the Discord actually. to remove bloatware. And Supposedly, it greatly improves your CPU. In oh, I almost got it! No, oh, no, it's stupid. It's almost worth going backwards to get it. <laughs> <laughs> 
so I get three extra strokes in my score. And of course it bounces off. Now I have to get it to make up for my two wasted throws. No, I can't. Wait, get two before somebody else does. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then get three. Oh, come on. Oh my god. No, I want it. Bonus. I want to get in there. I want it. This is a horrible yep. angle. Wait, Here, go right there. No. No. Now we're back to scratch. Like we're back like we never did a throw. I think if I did the math correctly. Two plus three, five. The new updates for it are really CPU heavy. Could just be Windows 10. Yeah, I was actually honestly con uh, considering uh, trying to downgrade my Windows to Windows 8 if that's even possible at this point. Because I literally use this computer for nothing but gaming. So like, it's not like I need, I mean, I don't even honestly know what features Windows 10 has that I would use that I would miss if I got rid of it. Probably nothing. Yeah, guys, I, I'm, I'm, I'm number one. Nice shot. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Hype it up, hype it up. Hype it up, hype it up. Yes. Wait, how do you get that hoodie? Um. Oh, the Five Nights at Freddy's one? Yeah. I played Five Nights at Freddy's VR. Wait, I have it, but... Oh, if you played Five Nights at Freddy's VR and then at one point they had a free hoodie you could get, they email you. Wait, on link. PS4 or on PC? On PC. Oh, freak, I'm on PS4. <laughs> How does the VR work on the PS4? Uh, I mean, it's kind of... It's nice, but... Yeah, it's had some problems with stabilization i've i've played it I'm before looking, i used to have at it. the back of my tv and my controls my controllers are like yeah they'll wig yeah. out yeah yeah i used to have it but the only game i ever played on it was skyrim and uh the blood something i can't remember what it was called rush for blood or blood rush of truth. blood blood and truth no, it was like Rush for Blood. It was like a little uh, roller coaster game. You were in a roller coaster and you had to shoot zombies as they ran at you. It was pretty cool. Huh. Oh. Yeah, bonus. So what? Oh no! Wee. Horrible throw. Cody, do you know if there's a way to do that? To go back to Windows 8 instead of Windows 10? Because, like, I would con seriously consider it. I would have to, like, back up my, uh... <laughs> I'd have to back up my Breath of the Wild folder so I don't lose my game save. But... Or maybe you could play Breath of the Wild the way it's supposed to be maybe? But then I'd have to pay 60 bucks for it. I mean, I could, but then I'd have to start the game all over again from the beginning. I, I'm bad at judging distance, apparently. <sighs> Turn right! Oh, you dumb dumb. You big dumb dummy head dumb dumb. These holes are like the worst. Oh, oh, no, not hard enough. What's that? Yes. <gasps> oh, oh. I know you could buy it from Microsoft and do a clean download. Hmm. That's like expensive, isn't it? Isn't Windows 8 still like 200 bucks or something? Oh. It, hey, it's in the water. Oh, well, I'll take it. Wait. No, no, how do I reset it? Oh, there it goes. I got the mercy rule. I got the mercy rule. I'll have to look into that. If it's not too expensive, I might consider it because it might be better than uh, upgrading my CPU and all that. This is my chance. 
Oh, oh, perfect throw. And then I had to ruin all of it. <laughs> It was the perfect setup. Dunked it. Hey, I'm in the lead. Whoopee. Whoopee. Just rub it in. I don't Whoopee. know where my princess is. Whoopee. Whoopee. I'm so good. Where is it? Whoopee. Like, did I, did I just bim come like that? There it is. Oh, I was going to say, you can reset okay. it, but it will put it right back to the beginning. Not, not anywhere near where it's supposed to be. Yeah, because that fan will blow it like way far away. Oh, it's there. Okay. I might have to consider that, Cody. I might have to try and download Windows 8. I'll do some research online and see if they say VR operates better on Windows 8. And if it does, I'm, I'll, I'll do it. Like Windows 10 doesn't make any difference to me at all. <laughs> now, the only thing I'm a little worried about is compatibility. Like if I download Windows 8 and then it's like, oh, by the way, nine times that you... 90% of the games you play, the new games that come out don't work. Game over. Uh, game over. You win. Yeah. High five, oh yeah. Nice one. Hey, someone got a box. Ooh, what'd I get, what'd I get? 50 Ooh. tokens. Yeah. They made it rain. You got something else. You got something else. <laughs> I did? Oh! Ready to start. What is this? Okay. Ten more tokens. Ten tokens! Holy crap! <laughs> dun, dun, dun. What next? Dun, She's dun. hiding in the pipe. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Are you swimming? I think what I would do before I do Windows 8, though, is I'd probably start with a clean Windows 10 install. And go from there. And then if the Windows 10 install doesn't show very much improvement, then I'd probably regress to Windows 8. Windows 8. I wish there was just like an option in Windows 10 to make like a very basic version. Like make your computer start with like minimal processes working. So then I can just start from like a baseline of nothing and then just start trying loading programs one at a time and see how much CPU each one takes. Press the start button on but the it could be because a lot of people online like on reddit and the forums and stuff say that ever since like march of this year half-life alex has not played well at all for them so it could just be that there was an update for half-life alex and it just completely killed it which is disappointing posted a video that i think might help you in the discord yeah i'll check it out Game on. if i had I wonder how badly it would mess this game up if I tried to download <laughs> another game while I'm playing. <laughs> I was gonna say if I had uh what was the frick? Uh my, my Trover installed right now, we'd try and play it here in a minute, but I don't think I do. Oh it's going, going, going. What's that? I said it doesn't take long to download Trover, does it? No, it shouldn't take very long. It's a small game. Well, boom. My goal this game is to beat Bubby. Yeah, three! All I want to do. So, so Cody, one thing I did read is, like, supposedly for some reason, I think there's one more left. when Steam is connected to the internet, anytime Steam is connected to the internet, it uh -oh, takes yeah. Steam's CPU oh, usage God. from, like, below 10% to like 35% and nobody seems to know why. Okay. They're just like, if you want to lower your CPU usage of Steam when you're playing a game, just disconnect it from the internet. And sure enough, when I tried that tonight, like it started running like a hundred times better and the CPU usage was like negligible. It was like hardly anything. And I have no idea like if there's a way you can make it stop doing whatever it's doing in the background, but keep it online at the same time. Because the CPU usage is actually pretty, like, pretty insane. Like, it <laughs> uses way more than any program should. What? No. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. My favorite hole is next. Where'd the other guy go? 
Oh. Hmm. He missed already. Off the game. Oh, did he really? Oh my God. Yeah. He must not like a conversation about trope. Uh, why can't I? Very anti trope. Ah, I gotta beat Bubby. I need to gain some strokes. Some people could be anti trope. It's a pretty, mm. it's pretty uh, adult oriented game. Oh no, that's a terrible throw. Oh, look at that. Sail right off into the distance. No, 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 no. That's not, that's not a good One, two, Calabunga! Snow, Cody says, Snow, you got this. <coughs> Cody, have you ever had a chance to play VR? Like one of the sensations in VR that to this day still surprises me is like your brain literally gets so tricked by it that if you fall from a high place, like you take a long fall, like it does that same weird feeling like flipping your stomach that it does in real life. So like in a VR game, if you jump from like a tall building and like look down, like you literally feel like you're getting vertigo and like you're falling. It's kind of weird. Only with my phone, I don't like it. Yeah, it takes a while. When I first started playing VR, there were only certain games I could play. And, like, any other games would make me motion sick. And, like, this game, the default movement is actually to, like, click. So, like, you would aim your hand at the ground someplace and hit a button and you would teleport there. And it's because in VR, teleportation movement is a lot easier to take than full motion movement. Like, full motion smooth movement, what they call it, will, like, cause VR sickness on new VR players instantly. It's really weird. Like, it took Not me a long time to build up, like... It took me a long... Yeah, I don't think... Yeah, I don't think you're going to be making any improvement on this one, but the next one you'll get. Maybe, but, like, maybe. it takes plan. a long time to build up your false sense of security. resistance to the VR sickness, but once you do, like, I can take months and months off of VR and come right back into it, and it's like, I never left. Like, my body doesn't get sick at all. It's really weird. One of the worst games for VR sickness is Senwa's Sacrifice as a VR mode, like a patch that released officially on the PC to make it VR. And like, it's super fun, but it makes you super motion sick if you've never played VR before. Because that was one of the very- oh my god, it's perfect. It's, it's the perfect cast. It was like one of the very first games I played when I got Steam VR on my computer. And like I vomited <laughs> a couple times the first time I played because it was like so intense Because not only is like the motion smooth like you walk in real time But like during the sword fights and stuff like you have to like keep rotating to like Track the guy that's fighting you and like block the sword attacks and stuff and like the motion was so intense Like I, I got so sick. I had to like take my headset off and run to the bathroom Are you, still, are you still shooting, Bubby? I have a chance. I'm trying. I thought my very first throw was perfect. It landed I like right. You had it. it landed right where Hyper's standing right now, and then like I just messed yeah. up every every throw since then. Okay, so I've got a, I've got a chance. What you're saying is that. Oh, it was right there. Oh man. It was going straight for the flag, and then the fans like, nope, not today, bud. I have a technique, but I don't know oh, how. No. No! no! Did you see that curve? I missed it by an I inch. I have a technique, but I don't know if it's gonna work. What's that? You gotta catch it. Uh, throwing on the fan, and after that, it's going on the, the, the thing. Gotcha. Yeah, you I think I, I got... The fan? I'm pretty sure I got the mercy rule. Oh, dang it. My frisbee's gone. Right here, right here. Yeah, that's what mine did earlier. It was flying straight at the flag and it got like right here and I was like, nope, denied. See ya. What'd you try to play on your phone on VR, Cody? So like this game is working fine on stream. So it's something about Half-Life Alex specifically just is not working. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say, you must be mercy. close. It's gotta be like one or two strokes give me mercy more. Or give, me death. <laughs> give me mercy or give me death. Oh, no. Nice, ridiculous. Oh, no. oh, you had your chance to catch up and you squandered it. Okay. <sighs> I still have a ch I'm gonna do it here, this hole, right now. 
Great. Oh, look at that perfect throw. <laughs> the perfect throw. I'm so good at this. I mean, humble, but good. You know what I'm saying? Some raft game. Oh, yeah, that sounds horrible. Like, even That's now. Not... Oh, how did that Oh, not that was so close. <laughs> even now, like, being used to VR. Um, there was a raft game I played. It was the last VR game I played on Twitch, actually, before it started acting up. There was, like, a kayak, and he had to row in the kayak. Like, that was a little motion sicky because, like, the water would rock you back and forth. And the first time I played that game, even though I'm, like, super used to VR, I was still like, oh, this is a little weird. Because, like, even when you're standing perfectly still, your character's, like, slowly wading back and forth. I was like, ooh, that's kind of weird feeling. It was a cool game, though. Like, you literally are, like, a, a special ops uh, soldier in a kayak, like, infiltrating an enemy base and killing them. Where? Oh, no. It was a weird Wait, first shot or second shot, buddy. Third, I got it in three. It was a weird idea for a game though, because you literally never leave the kayak the entire game, and you Dang get like it. different Dang weapons. It. Like you get a pistol with a silencer, you get a sniper rifle with a silencer, and like the whole game you're in a kayak just sneaking through the enemy base, killing people without getting seen. It was really weird, but it was really fun. Had a lot of the big cinematic moments too, like helicopter crashes and tanks. It was pretty interesting. There's a Medal of Honor game coming out at the end of this year for VR too. I'm really interested to see what that's going to be like. No, no, Hate no, to no. go, but final push no, for work. No, no. Have a good no. one, Cody. If you if I'm still here, <laughs> we'll see you when you get back. Oh, it just barely hit the the obstacle. This is running really smooth considering right, I'm streaming. <laughs> oh, you got in the way! She smacked you in the head. <laughs> Maybe you saved it actually by knocking it around with your head. That was, that's exactly what I did. <laughs> yeah. No one will defeat me on this day. Oh, rejected! How did that happen? Um... What? Got the two and the three, but it took me three strokes to do it. Probably not worth it in the long run. Oh, 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 come on, that was so close. Oh, oh robbed. How many strokes did I do? How many? How many? Where's the scoreboard? Where's the scoreboard? Seven. Is, a score... totally, like, Is there not a scoreboard on this hole? I guess not. I think we have to all finish first. Then. We have to finish first. What? Gotcha. <laughs> I actually went back and got both the three and the two bonus point. <laughs> but it took me like four strokes to do it, so it didn't really count. Look at that! Like I said, it took me four strokes to get the three and the five bonus, but then, or the three and the two, and then it only took me two more throws to get it in. Dang it. Oh, oh my god, what? perfect throw! Oh, that's the first time I've ever done that. That's awesome. But then I hit the hazard. I kind of hate you right now. <laughs> right? That was a good shot. So now my stroke's down below 10. It's like 9. Oh, I guess it doesn't count it until after the after the hole. I did it again. Oh my god. <laughs> Hazard again. Poop. I'm throwing it way too hard. I'm going to lose all four of these bonus strokes. There we go. Keep it away from the water, please. There we go. There we go. 
I threw it too hard. Oh, don't go, don't go, don't go. God dang it, Bobby. Slow and steady wins the race. Too hard. Son of a gun. Son of a gun. This hard this hole sucks just as much as the fan one. Sure it does. It's, they did all kinds of scientific tests. I hate this one so much. This is almost worse than the fan one, in my opinion. Yes. Oh no, mercy. So much for those four bonus strokes I got. I wasted all those real quick. Did you get the mercy roll or did you? No, I got it in, but I'm pretty sure I still took like six extra strokes on top of the four bonus ones. Eight! You're still kicking our butt. Perfect timing. Perfect. Oh, it was almost a hole in one. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Do the dance. Do the dance. 16. Maybe they can catch up. Maybe someone will get negative 20 strokes on this hole. Fancy, get dancy. Don't get fancy, just get dancy. Yep, exactly. Yeah. Who sings that? What, what, what's pink. Quote from a song? Pink. Okay, good. I have pink on my Apple Music player right now. No, 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 no! Please don't. Pink is one of my <laughs> favorites. Yeah. Cause you, cause you know why? Cause you're fucking perfect. I mean, you're <gasps> effing perfect. This is a family-friendly stream. No, I'm just playing. Game over. I have never once clicked family-friendly on my streams. <laughs> just I because I know I'm gonna go play Beat Saber. Goodbye. All right, have fun. Thanks for joining. Oh, where'd my? Did I not get any? Just because I know my personal uh, experience is I have a tendency to get a little frustrated and then start throwing magic words around. You know, your selfie is still pretty mild Ready to start. compared to. That's because I know I'm being watched, so I'm like, oh, I need to calm down a little bit before I throw a controller someplace. Right, because your current viewers would be so offended. <laughs> like, you son of a... <laughs> I'm, I'm never watching this streamer ever again. Yeah, exactly. Filthy mouth. All five of them would leave forever. You got a box. Oh, no, you're not going to empty your... Open oh, your no. box. I didn't get a box this time. What Neither did I. I don't know what causes that. Like, I think it's the first time you play an activity for the day, and then if you get, like, a personal best high score, you get a box. Oh, yeah, that was not... Which my point. personal best on this is, like, five, so, I mean... Right, right. I Humble, but braggadocious <laughs> at the same time. Press the start button on the scoreboard to play. Want to do one more, or...? Uh, either this or paintball. Do the regular frisbee golf, maybe? Sure. Maybe Which I one? can kick your ass at that one. Wait, is there a way to change on the board over here? I think there is. No, no, there is not. So, like, one thing that's always one thing that's always confused me is like, read this board here. I've never you figured just out. Help the... I have never found what? out how to play that. Like, I've tried online before. The mode? I can't figure out where that button is. There's no mode. Right, that's what I'm saying. Like, I, I've never been able to figure this out. Mm -hmm. It sounds really fun, but I have no idea how to do it. Maybe if we go to this room. Create, wait, settings? Game options, yeah, yeah, yeah. Nope, doesn't even Press have it the in there. Button on the scoreboard to play. What if, what if we do this room? No, 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 no. Stop. Do you private? This room, that's what I was trying. Except for some reason I keep 
missing that room details. Create a private room. Yes. We're going to try it, see if we can figure this co-op catching mode out. Seems like it could be fun. Ready Seems start. like it could be fun. Oh no, she's not here. Nope. I don't know. Frisbee eagle. Frisbee eagle. Frisbee eagle. Frisbee eagle. Frisbee golf. Trying to find frisbee golf. Trying to find frisbee golf. Fall guys. There we go. Yeah, that's the one. That's the stuff. Hostish. Ready to start. Where did she go? She's gone. She's gone forever. There we go. Hello. I thought I'd lost you. No, I decided to, like when you create a private room, you can't just change it from the bonus mode to the regular mode. You have to create a whole new room in the regular mode. But I still don't see a mode button. Maybe you have to have a full room, Press like four people. Button on the scoreboard to play. Huh. What other VR games do you have? Who, me? Yeah. Game on. Uh. Oh, uh. Here, oh, no. I'm not good thinking on my feet. I'm red this time. Oh, no. Like outside of rec room? Yeah. Like, you have Half-Life Alex 2, right? Yeah. You have, do you still have Boneworks? I do. Supposedly a mod yeah. came out for Boneworks that makes it co-op. <gasps> what? Or like, not even co-op. I think it's actually it. like, I don't even think it's co-op. I think it's just like a versus deathmatch mode. Oh wait, that does not sound as appealing. <laughs> <laughs> Co-op, like they should make a VR co-op first-person shooter game. That'd be awesome. This is much more relaxed than that silly bonus mode. Man, I'm doing horrible though. Get out of here! Don't you dare! Don't you dare kick it! Don't you dare block it! I don't have feet. <laughs> it's a good. It's a damn good thing too. <laughs> I've actually been thinking about replaying Boneworks, but I feel like I have to finish Half Life first. Yeah, I re-downloaded a bunch of VR games, and then uh, when all this stuff started acting up, I actually wiped all of my VR games off my computer to see if that would fix it. Yep. Which did not. It's a good troubleshooting technique, I still suspect Breath of the Wild. Yeah, oh, probably no. is. Did you just get it in two? Yep. Yeah, because the thing oh, is, like, it. with Steam, if you download all of your games in the same drive that Steam is downloaded to, if you uninstall Steam, it uninstalls all of your files with all of your all games, of your too. Game. Uh, so I uninstalled Steam not realizing that, and then I reinstalled Steam, and all of a sudden my library was empty. I was like, you son of a gun. I was oh, like, no. 20 hours worth of downloading games. But at least you weren't in the middle of any of those games, right? No, so, I, I wasn't playing any Steam games at the, at the moment, no. That's good. Yeah! Yeet, yeet, yeet it! Oh, that was, what's that? Wow, you must have had a horrible backswing on that. Oh, 
Oh yeah, oh yeah. Who's the best? Who's the best? It's me in case you didn't know. It's me in case you didn't know. Get out of my way. Get, just quit your taunting. It's me in case you didn't know. It's me in case you didn't know. Oh, I know. <laughs> yeah. Hey. That would have actually been a dick move if you <laughs> tried to throw the frisbee right then. So I was just trying to reach that leaf, that. but then I, I didn't really- Oh, you can, yeah. That's why I was like, that would have been a dick uh, move if you tried to throw it right when I jumped in front of you. Yeah. Oh, goodness. What happens if I catch it? Catch my own throw? I did it earlier. It still counts as a stroke. Oh, it does. <laughs> I wasn't right. trying to cheat or anything. I was just seeing what happened. It was scientific research. <laughs> oh, I was totally trying to cheat by doing that earlier. <laughs> You're not far behind, though. You're only two strokes behind. Oh, I thought you gained along. You got pull. Oh, okay. Oh, if I didn't right, have the natural good. curve, that could have been a one shot. Yeah. I forgot to hit the jump button. I was trying to knock it back for you so it would land on the ground. Oh, oh. But I jumped in. I jumped in real life instead of pressing the jump button. In <laughs> really? A little bit. Oh, I lifted my body up a little. I'll block it. I'll, I'll get. The, I'll get the rebound. I'll get the rebound. Oh, it actually counted. It hit the water. That's cheap. It shouldn't have counted that. It's not even if it just hit like the edge. Get out of here. Is your headset needing constant adjustment? Yeah, it's kind of loose right now, and I don't want to mess with it, so I'm just. I got gotcha. you. Constantly sliding it back up. Yeah, back before when I was streaming. Like I just keep like. Yeah, you keep like. My head. Back before when I was like regularly streaming VR and like playing VR all the time, I had perfect fit on this headset. And then one day my kids came into my house and started adjusting it and like playing with it. And since then it's never yeah. fit the same again. I'm like I can never yeah. find it again. If, if I had a good fit and then I messed with it one day and I haven't ever been able to get that back. Yeah, that sweet spot is really hard to hit perfectly. Oh my. God. Whee. Dunked it. Who's the man? Who's the man? Alright, where is this? I dunked mine. It's around the corner. You dunked it? Oh, I missed. I missed. Yeah, this game seems to run perfectly fine, but there's two things about that. One is it doesn't run in Steam. And two, I'm just going to take a wild guess that this probably isn't anywhere near as intensive as Half-Life Alex is. <laughs> <laughs> you think? I mean, that's going out on a limb there. But... I mean, the graphics here are pretty top tier, I'm not gonna lie. I mean, there's a lot going on here. There's like wind and trees. Physics, I mean, there's physics. It's gotta process a lot of information. So much the physics because my frisbee went right through the solid fence. <laughs> Same did yours. Oh, cool! I could pick it up from this side. That's pretty awesome. Well, that's cheating. I'm putting a ticket in. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, like I feel personally offended by your game because you let my opponents cheat by warping their arm through a wall. I totally could have reached over the fence in real life. Sure. Because people have seven foot arms that can reach <laughs> to the bottom of a fence. <laughs> well, that, there goes my hole. Now, now I'll never be able to make this. You mess up the first time, you'll never come back. Oh, 
he says as he made it in four shots. <laughs> oh, you... Quit it. Who's the best? I'm the best. Who's the best? Oh, I'm the best. Why didn't you knock that down? I tried. I actually reached my arm out, except I don't know if I can actually hit it or not. Because that would have been, like, perfect. Yeah, let's see. Let's see. Let's Hold on. Go for the, go for the flag. For you. Uh. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> High five. <laughs> that was a perfect shot. That's actually funny did that that, that worked. Did that count as <laughs> it did. A, another stroke? Or did uh, it? I don't know. Did you count your strokes? I didn't. You were at eight. That was pretty funny. I'm surprised that worked. <laughs> so do we go for the trick shot over the rocks and risk getting a hazard, or do we go around? Oh. Over. That did not work. <laughs> hazard. Uh. Now we're now we're invested. There we go. Oh, I could have gotten the bonus. No. I forgot this one still had bonuses. Between you and me, I don't think I'm gonna need it. <laughs> I heard that. What? What are you talking about? Why are you eavesdropping on me in chat? She must be trying the same trick I did, but failing miserably. <laughs> it's trying to get the bonus. <laughs> they were like, no, you must not walk on the sacred ground. <laughs> hey, your frisbee's right here. Yeah, get out of my way. I wish it tracked in real time how many strokes you've taken so we could experiment and see what I can do with it without affecting your stroke account. <laughs> It does, it does, so that was so good really? for me. Yeah. How do, you, how do you see that? When every time I pick up, when you pick up the frisbee, it tells you. What? It doesn't know my game. Yeah, it does. Okay, so I'm gonna hit, I'm gonna aim it at you. Okay. And knock it in, okay? Ugh. I didn't <laughs> know you were throwing it. <laughs> that was terrible. Okay, so this is stroke 11. Did it, did it hit me? I think when it's in the air, the only thing it will interact with is my face, because I tried to smack it with my hand, and it went through my hand and hit my face. So I have to aim for your face. Pretty much, and then I have to headbutt it in. Yeah. Hey, you got a box again. What the heck? Level 10? You're growing up. You got a Michael Jackson sweater. Did that change? Did that change? It did, actually, yeah. You look like right. you got a you got a Michael Jackson sweater. Ready to start. And ten tokens rained on you. Randomly. That is a horrible sweater, by the way. Right. Disgusting. It's a horrible sweater? I don't. It's a horrible. It's not as cool as Five Nights at Freddy's. It is not. That is true. Nothing is as cool as Five Nights at Freddy's. Can you not change your clothes? I guess not. You have to be inside your dorm. That's kind of silly. Yeah. You have You'd think they'd the be, they'd let you carry your clothes around in your backpack to switch into. <laughs> Hold on. Before the Just next game. Changing the, the next woods. Game, I'm going to go behind the tree over there. Before the next game, let's all hang out right here. Oh, I guess there's no, uh, yeah, there is. Okay. There's a table. Hang over here. What are you looking for? We're going to, we're going to celebrate the fun times that we've had. Press the start button on the you? scoreboard to play. Behind you. I can't even... Oh, there you are. Have some donuts. <gasps> yes! How did you do that? I'm hungry. And some root beer. Hi, Spidey Bat. You want donuts and root beer? Thank you. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> yeah. What are you guys doing? Have a, have a donut. Have some root beer. Try the donuts? Okay. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> mm. Oh, it actually eats it. That's hilarious. Oh, that's so good. Give me another one. 
I'm probably What's gonna that? eat all the donuts, donuts guys. This is so good. They are delicious. No, you guys better not. Someone can fi finish that one. I'll finish. Shit. No. I'm having the chocolate. That's ridiculous. <laughs> Here, have some root beer. Have some root beer? Okay. So hospitable. Hey, give me. I want to. I try. I try to be a good host. Hey, I want more. Uh. Oh, so so there's there's a thing about there's that. There's not more. I don't. I don't have any more. Just kidding. Salted pretzels for everybody. <laughs> yes. <laughs> mm. You guys, this is pretty salty, guys. Where's the cheese? Yeah, I don't think I have any more drinks. That's the problem. Wait a second. I do. Oh, root beer for everybody. Oh. Root beer, let's go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I knew you could break them. You just gotta throw them hard. I mean, eating and drinking PR is pretty awesome. <laughs> that. Hey, give me that root beer. Up yeah, see, oh, even with the full room, it still doesn't give you the option to play the co-op catch mode. That's weird. You guys are such a waste there. There's more. Did you just chuck a bottle at my head? I bought that root beer. <laughs> Alright, now we can play on a full stomach like you're supposed to. What? Actually, I'm pretty sure you're not Plus, supposed to play on a full stomach. I want my, uh, my white water rafting on empty stomach, so... Food is important. Game on. What is the it? Heck? They always tell you not to do stuff with the empty with the full stomach. Or is it the other way around? Don't do things with the empty stomach. I don't know. That's what... I don't know. Like, you're not supposed to do water activities with a full stomach, because you'll cramp up if you fall in. No, you're not. But if you're too hungry that you can't think straight, it's dangerous. I'm pretty sure that's an uh, old wives' tale anyway. <laughs> I don't think you actually cramp up if you eat. Uh, yes, you do. What'd you say? Yeah, you do? Yeah, you do. No, you don't. That's fake. I swear during the Olympics, I watched Michael Phelps eat a slice of pizza right before he raced. Damn, good job, Snowflake. Maybe it wasn't oh, a, maybe it wasn't a full everybody. stomach. Maybe like one pizza five. slice was enough to give him like a quarter stomach. Snowflake, give me high five. Snowflake, oh. give me high five. Oh yeah. yeah. Good job. Oh yeah. Good job. Good job. That was so close. You got robbed. What? That was even closer. Oh my love. Oh yeah. There we go, that's a little better. <laughs> okay. Yeah, after a while of playing it does start putting a little pressure on your head. What? <laughs> I got a frisbee. What? Why are you guys circling me? <clears throat> I know how to throw a frisbee. Where'd you go? Uh, you, good you job, good job. You? Let's you go! What's that? You had to go. Relieve yourself. No. Oh. You, you disappeared. I was looking around because I know there's secret stuff hidden on the map someplace, but I don't know where it is. Oh, that's right. Like the sword? Is yeah. that this map or is it all of them? I think it's all of them. That was a horrible throw, by the way. It's not my chance. I'm gain on Bubby here. I'm gonna get two. You can. Oh, I did! Oh, you're one ahead of me now. Ah. Ah. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, now I'm comfortable. 
I know you're comfortable. Now you're going to break out the perfect game. Now I found my rhythm. That's what's going on. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, you had to wear the Cosby sweater to get it. <laughs> Is, does it have patterns? I, don't, I didn't even look at it. I just put it on. It has like a blue and green triangle on either side. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> Hello. Oh yeah. Oh, number number five, I think. Wait, eight. Hey, yes, go, baby. Bonus. Uh -oh. So you said when you pick up the frisbee, it supposedly tells you what stroke you're on. Oh shoot, I missed the bonus. Oh, dang it. Um, yeah. Well, Where does it show it? No, and it says stroke two at the bottom of the screen. I don't think mine does that. No, it definitely does not. Huh. Just for me, I don't know. Maybe it's a setting why, I turned off or something. Yeah. Let's see. Okay, you're oh! You're making two on me! <laughs> it took me three, so Shoot. if it took you three, then you're good. No, because I got the bonus. No, I think... Yeah. Did you get the bonus? No, I did not. Oh, man, how'd you miss it? <laughs> <laughs> I hit the corner of it. <laughs> it's like the size of a barn right in front of you. <laughs> it's, it's like regular frisbee golf, where if there's a tree right in front of you, you will hit it. And if right. there's a goal right in front of you, you will miss it. Right. I'll probably be doing some Among Us tomorrow, because I know uh, Voss was trying to play it. Oh, I'd love to. I'm gonna have my kids far away, potentially going after they're in bed. Yeah. I'll have to see if I can find enough people to play to a match, because I think you have to have five people to start a match. I bet you can come up with that. I think Nate might I be playing Nate's it again. Playing. Nate's played it like every night for the past week. It's definitely pretty popular right now. Apparently. I might actually download VR Chat as much as I've specifically avoided it just to play oh, the version really? of Among Us that's in VR Chat, because it looks really good. Oh, I didn't well, know there was a version in VR chat. Yeah, and the character oh, models are actually the Among Us people, just like they're. You guys, I'm not good. I'm not good. Oh, it happens. You're a higher level. Well, you're a higher I like level. I like your shirt. Template. Thank you. What am I? Ooh, Ten? and your little emoji is cute. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're level 10, Snowflake. Right. I think I'm 21. I think I just got it yesterday. Yeah, you Next hole. This one's the sucky one. Then the one after this is even more sucky. Oh, I just barely made it across the water. Why am I limp on my throws? Got it in four. Got him four. Oh, that was a good throw. That was your first throw? No, oh, that was my second. Oh, I was going to say that was a really good throw. It's a good start. But now oh. I know it was your second throw. It's less impressive. Don't you dare. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see if it counts it as a does. stroke. It, it did not. Ooh, nice. Well, then I regret it. I appreciate it. <laughs> I'm helping you get closer to beating me. I think I, we'll be waiting for the other I two players for a while. I with your help. I want to beat you fair and square. Well, then, uh, I guess you're going to have to try again some other time. <laughs> mm -hmm. Got her. I think this one's the next one. I think the one I'm standing in is the next one, but that would be kind of messed up for you to just stand here and make it so nobody can get it in. <laughs> that would kind of be, a uh, rude. Nah. I think it would be hilarious.
How are you flying? I'm standing on the sign. Oh, I thought you were like standing on your couch or something. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how I got up here, but it's kind of cool. You should try. You should try that. Wait, wait. Where is my? I got I don't it. Know where my couch is. Oh, hi. I'm taller than you. You. Okay, there's my. Oh, it took me off the sign. Hold on. Yeah, me too. Now I really am standing on my couch, but you can't tell. Okay. <laughs> That's funny. I'm surprised it doesn't actually show a height difference when you're standing on your couch. Oh, you're one stroke away from me. I'm gonna catch up. I'm giving you a false sense of security. Hey guys. I see, I see. You guys know how to do the renegade? No, what's that? How do you do it? It's a dance. You, okay, just Stop. follow me, okay? Three, two, one. Mm. Mm. <laughs> like clap. Mm, like, okay. So, from the top. Mm. Bum, 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 bum. Wait, renegade. <laughs> you guys like wait like this? Wait, renegade, 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 renegade. Rule. You lost me. Da, da, da. Oh, and then Ooh. you end with that, huh? Wow. Ha, ha. Boom, 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 boom. You did it! <laughs> you halfway, okay? I couldn't even follow. That was way too much. <laughs> I don't even know how to put my finger up. How do you do that? Uh, the, the A button or whatever? I'm... You guys want to learn another oh, one? It. You guys want to learn another one? Sure. Oh my gosh, I don't care. Okay, so this is a. Uh, okay, this just follow me. Okay. Okay, see this? Sad. Big. Yeah, hit him. Love. Did somebody? Did somebody break your heart? Looking like an angel, but you're savage, love. When you kiss me, I don't give to be, but I still want that. The savage love. <laughs> We're not. <laughs> uh, you wanna do the, um, uh, I already did that one. Okay, ready? Hey, you saw that, bub. That was close. I'm a savage. <laughs> it was close. Okay, ready? I'm a savage. I'm a savage. Ready? I'm a savage. Oh. Where's my frisbee? Give me that. Let's see who gets it first. Let's see who gets it first. You ready? I'll watch. I'll be watching from here. Oh, that's way too high. There's no way I can catch that. That's 500 miles above my head. My goodness. Can we get some good frisbee golf players around here, please? Some good frisbee golf players. Oh, I'll smack it down. Wow, that thing just like stopped dead in midair and dropped like a brick. Choking me. Nice one. That wasn't too many strokes. Uh, I'll be honest, this hole kind of cheated for me because for half of the hole, my frisbee was sitting right here in the middle of the water. Like it didn't, it didn't oh. hazard it out or anything. So. So this game is just a complete. This game's a complete waste. Yeah, it's like a waste of my yeah. whole life. Yeah. My whole life leading up to this moment has just been a complete waste. So your score really should be like eight or nine right now. So I'm no, that's so <laughs> <laughs> Oh, 
very frustrating. I think she got the mercy rule. Yeah. Now you guys want to learn the savage or nah. the beauty? I'm not much of a dancer. I don't know about your dance moves on stream has been pretty on point. I don't know about that. I mean, we got to do it. We're right here. Oh, no. We wasted a stroke to gain a stroke. I don't think that's really going to pay off. But that perfect throw afterwards, though. Oh, squandered. It was squandered. Nailed it. It's not a waste. Thank you, Cody. I appreciate that. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Denied. Denied. Going in. Going in. Oh, Ugh. I tried to push it back, but I couldn't get under it. The fence stopped me. How's work going, Cody? Wait, am I supposed to... It's right here. There you go. Okay. Oh, I was going to flip it in. Oh, I feel like you. <laughs> Throw it, put your back into it. <laughs> you got it? No, I'm trash at this. Writing up reports and closing up, that sounds fun. What do you have to write reports on? Don't you work at like a... What do you do for... You do something like... Dealing with livestock or something, don't you? Or is that like way off? It's like kind of like a farm type of deal. I will hide behind the rock and sneak up on my prey. Yeah! Double fives. <laughs> That's called ten. Yeah, that is ten, I guess, yeah. If you want to be technical about it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I didn't major in math or anything, but... Did you? No. Manage a student union hall. The reports are about what happened in a day. Why the heck did I think you like worked on a farm or something? Where did I get that from? Must have been imagining things. Uh. You give me it. Thank you. I was trying. What? I was trying. I'm sorry. <gasps> I apologize. Oh my gosh, I so suck at this. Because <laughs> I live on a farm. Oh, that makes more sense. Huh? I know how good you guys are. Um, I, I play this every day for like seven hours a day. That's how I feel about some people who play like Call of Duty and stuff. They have to play it like constantly. Oh. Are you guys on VR or like can, like PS4? VR. VR. I'm on VR too. Oh, what the heck? Oh, what to say? Yeah, it's uh, the computer the VR. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm trying to make it on top. No, give me that. Give me it. Oh, you're, you're there. You're going to get it. Yeah. Yes. Yes. I'm a right. winner, dude. Yeah, yeah, I'm a yeah, winner, dude. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> you're a winner. Yes. Finally. 
funny. But where's that other girl? Now look, everybody's gonna be like, oh man, that was a horrible throw. What was he thinking? Don't worry about it. I got this. I got this. If only I could find my frisbee. If only I could find my frisbee. It's in the bush somewhere. Uh, where are you, frisbee? Where is it? It's in the bush. It's in the bush somewhere. I don't know where it is. I lost it. I lost my frisbee, guys. Oh, it's all the way up there on the rock. What the heck? How'd that happen? No, or is it on the other side? It's on the other side of the rock. I'm the pro! That's the first time I've ever made it over there on one throw. No wonder my rotator cuff hurts. Whew, that's a lot of work. Nailed it! Who is the best? Not me. I'm sure people get, like, negative in this game. Where's everybody else at? Come on, you're holding up progress. Oh, I'm coming, I'm I coming. see it. It's coming. Get the bonus. Okay, where's the first thing? Oh, this is going to ruin you. <laughs> oh, at least there's no water over on this side. I was actually waiting for it yeah. to go through and then land in the water. That would be appropriate. No pressure, but I finished with four. Yeah, no, no, there's no way I'm beating you. Yeah, 18! Oh. I don't even think that counts this hole. I think I have to uh. Does it? What? Why am I getting so oh, I don't, I don't, okay. Good game, good game, good game. From me. <gasps> I got a box for once. Uh, oh. Okay, now I've got a hat. Woohoo! Oh! Ooh, you got a beret. Fancy. I'm just changing my look every You look Friendly. like you're a professional okay, golfer. Wait, where are you? Where are you? Where's your hands? You gotta open hey. your hands. Like, yeah. do I have to do this or do I have to do this? No, it's an open hand and then you shake. Oh. <laughs> Doesn't, it's not working. There you go, there you go. <laughs> no. no, we're just... There just, we go. Yay! Oh, here we go. Yay, yay, we're friends! <laughs> okay. Oh, look at look yay. at my new dance that I made. Okay, look. Ready? She's a dancer. Nice, All nice. Right. I can picture it now. This is great. Have you played Beat Saber? That's like what you do the entire game is you dance. Ooh! Do that. And then there's a game called Just Dance in VR that you just dance the entire time. <laughs> Wanna play some uh, paintball? Boom! Boom! Da boom! Da boom! Thanks for playing. Paintball. We're doing paintball. Yeah, the stream seems to be going well with this game. I don't know what's going on with Alex. <laughs> Forget Alex. We'll never play Alex Listen. again. Alex is out of here. Alex is gone. Deleting Alex. Delete. Get out of here, Alex. Never again. We will never successfully finish the gnome run. I don't think we even got to the point in Alex where you get the gnome. That's how fast it crashed. Like, we literally didn't even get to the beginning of the game. Oh no, Snowball's not here. What happened? Game on. Oh no. There we go. 
I joined the game. It's empty. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm on a loading screen. A loading screen. It's a big black loading screen. Here I am. Here I am. We're going to play capture the flag. Then I'm going to shoot you. Target practice. Target practice. Target practice. Oh, man. You're blue. You've got blue all over your face. I shot all over your nice new sweater. <laughs> nice new sweater is getting all paint on it. Oh my god, the sweater is all blue now. Yeah. It only lasts for a couple seconds and it fades off. Yeah, what you what you do to you? Get off my screen, old pirate man. I don't want to see this. Teleportations for fools. Hopefully somebody else comes in here. This could be a really quick game. No, I can't hear you anymore. I wasn't pressing the push to talk button. Sure, okay, you're fine. Can you Take this. Wait, going to rec center? Are you going to rec center? I'm you not going doing? to rec center. Oh, okay. Are you going to rec center? Apparently, she's going to rec center. Do 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 I don't wanna buy stuff, get out of here, get off my screen. Level 22. White gloves. Oh yeah, I'm futuristic. Activity completed. White gloves! Oh, they're different, they're like golf gloves. Nice. Oh, they didn't go on. Poop. Yo, is that Lucas? Hello. I got new okay. gloves. Oh, hi. I, oh, yeah, we have I to said no going. Pump. Okay. And now we can go play paintball. Okay. I think I leveled up. You so did I for some reason. Yeah, I don't know why. Yeah. You went up. You went up two not. two levels tonight. Hi, hot potatoes. How's it going? Welcome to the stream. Thanks for checking it out. We're just testing the stream tonight. Like, we originally started playing Half-Life Alex, but it crashed horribly. So now we're just trying to, like, fool around in Rec Room on stream to see how well it runs. Because for some reason, streaming VR game is, like, really difficult for the computer to handle. It crashes constantly. And I would like to start streaming more VR games, but if it keeps crashing, we can't do it. So we're just kind of casually fooling around, playing some silly games, see how, see how well it works. Get up there! Oh, come on, get up! Oh, it didn't work. Is there nobody on this team? Oh, they're all gonna turn around. No! You didn't hear that? The red flag wasn't taken. Go back home. Oh. Good job. I don't know what to say. <laughs> Climb the wall. Oh, I can't get high enough. Climb the wall. Got it. Where'd she go? Oh. Good job. Good job. even on the team? Oh, she's on the opposite team. Gotcha. She killed one person. Oh, she's ruthless. I haven't killed anybody. Oh no, I didn't defend my guy. I hit someone. I got hit. I'm dead. Why are none of my notifications working? Ha <laughs> ha! 
I was in my options. At? Trying to figure out why none of my notifications are working. It's not even telling me when I hit somebody. change that setting or what I did. It used to always tell me when I hit somebody or when someone hit me, it would tell me their name on the screen. But for some reason none of the notifications are working. Oh, a direct shot in the face. Ah, you're right. This is so weird. <laughs> it's pretty fun. Like, it's a free game. You can download it for free and play on the computer, too. You don't have to have VR. It's actually pretty, like, the capture the flag mode is, like, the best mode in the game. I play it all the time. I didn't know he was coming for me. Oh. Snowflake, get her, get her. No, man, I'm not getting anybody. My aim is not good. They're at our flag, though. We gotta stop them. No, I won't let you, I won't let you. Man, that was a close one. That was a close one. Good rally, team, good rally. We're doing good. Then not kill him. I don't know how that grenade didn't get you. Yeah, I, I have no idea how that grenade missed you. Oh gosh, there's fire everywhere. I'm gonna die. Oh, and it's me versus the entire opposite team. No, the blue flag was taken by Snowball of all people. He has forsaken us. Sneak in, sneak in. Be sneaky. That wasn't very sneaky. <laughs> oh gosh. Why do I not have a gun? Where's my gun? It loaded me without a gun, that's cheap. Loaded me without a gun. <laughs> no, my aim is so bad. Did it even? Oh no, we're getting our butt kicked. So close to tasting victory. Man, Snowball got it all three times. Goodness. 
Oh crap. Man, we got kicked, man. We got our butt kicked. Good game. Good game, good game. Thanks. <laughs> it is. It is. Man, you crushed oh, us. Oh, you guys. <laughs> yeah, that's you what you get for playing. <sighs> I didn't mean to. All right. 20. I'm standing points. back here. Apparently, that was a horrible, horrible mistake. Not bad. Thank you. <laughs> you got all three flags, didn't you? That was this game. No, I only got one of them. I stole it a couple times. I only scored once. You didn't get that last one? I scored the last one, yes. Oh, okay. I thought I saw you got it. Yeah, I saw you steal it a few times. Thank you. I, I thought I'd just dress it up a little bit. Yeah. Hey, Awesomeness. How's it going? I'm doing all right. How are you? We're trying to test out some streaming VR games because it has not been working very well. Uh, it was a game. So we're trying to see if we can at least I'm make it work it. well yeah. enough to play yeah. a few yeah. rounds yeah. in here. <laughs> Why does it keep picking her? Did I accidentally just hit dorm? I think I did. Or rec room. Yeah, I thought so. Here we go. For some reason, like, my computer used to run VR just fine, but now it, like, struggles to run it. So I'm trying to see if I can actually stream VR again or not, because I used to do it all the time. Like, almost every night I would stream a VR game. What's that? Oh, we got each other. That's no good. No good. This is my favorite map, though. Oh, Bubba, you're red now! Yay! Yeah. Just by coincidence, because I think for some reason it keeps dropping us out of party. This is the worst thing. No! <laughs> that was a good reaction. How's our flag taken? Everybody's right here. How did I not hit you? How did I not hit you? It must be a lag or something. There we go. <laughs> now I got you. Wow, she's crushing us. Red flag dropped. Red flag taken. Wonder if any of these people are using mods. Good job, good job. Blue team scores. Oh, great grenade. Yes, sir. <laughs> it's always funny to see people who are new to VR playing it for like the very first time, you can tell, because they're just like really silly. Trying to figure out what their hands can do. Oh, jeez. Nice shot. Thank Is you. it Bub Bubby? Or no? Bubby Ruski, yeah. But the other person was Snowflake. No! Furious George got me. Thank you, thank you. No, 
Nice, Dang. nice. Yeah. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> That's ridiculous. I'm surprised I did not get shot. Okay. I was gonna say there were like five bullets flying right at me. How did I not get shot? It's totally this. I thought you were dead. There was a skull floating over his head. It was his partner's. Now you're dead that time. Good play, good play. I think he specifically hid behind his partner's skull so we would think he was dead. That was pretty smart. grenade throw. She always takes out like the entire team with one grenade. No, he got me. That guy's pretty good. That guy is pretty good. Oh, good shot. Oh, finally got your back. Good shot. Mess that up. Nice. Seems like it's kind of a stalemate. Nailed it. Nice shot. Good shot. Thank you. This game is so funny. Everybody's so nice. Nice one. Nice one. <laughs> Faster reflexes than I do. Oh, she got him. Nice. Mess that up. Try again. Here, where'd he go? Did he get booted? No, he was behind me. Nice one. I was trying to find you. <laughs> I 
I'm out of practice, man. I used to be able to shoot those grenades from forever away. He's on our side someplace. I don't know where he went. Oh, somebody else killed. Nice one. They're storming us. They're storming us. The whole team's coming. No, we gotta stop them. They're gonna win. Oh, I hit him. I hit him. Game legged on me. No! <laughs> nice. Cows on the bus go moo, moo, moo. They do. They do do that. Oh, nice hit. Oh, I was going to catch it, but then the game ended and it froze me up. Ugh. Oh, good game, good game. Good game. Good game. Good game. Whoa, that's that. insane. That's Are good. Are you impressed with me? Yeah, even as you were <laughs> distracted by Flynn Rider. All right. Um, I'm just as a Bubby. I want you to change the pronunciation of your name. Why is that? To what? Boobies. Booby Ruski would be better. You know why? Booby Ruski? <laughs> there's not enough. There's not enough boobies in Rex room. That is true. There is not enough boobies in Rex room or life in general. <clears throat> I wish there were just more boobies everywhere. Personally, right? Ah, yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Snowflake, you were on a, my team for a second. Game on. <gasps> no, you were on blue yeah, for I'm a second, for and then you got knocked down. <laughs> I didn't hear anything after blown you. <laughs> <laughs> of course not. <laughs> we were talking about um, cartoon characters that we talked about. Jessica Rabbit. Some rockin' music right there. No, 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 no. Get out. Why is that glitching? Gotcha, gotcha. Dang it. Team scores. Or not Y. Hold, um, right button. The left button. Did you get it? Oh, the bingo box? Red flag taken. <laughs> that was a great hit. <laughs> that was a great hit. This thing has deadly accuracy. Blue team scores. They're gonna come kill me now though.
nobody's here. <laughs> I'm surprised I, they didn't come chase me. She has no idea where it's coming from. <laughs> That's hilarious. Red flag taken. <laughs> oh my god, I am cleaning up. This is insane. Blue team scores. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> See how many you know what, you know what, See how many kills I got with that sniper rifle? Yeah, I experienced that. I got you like five times in a row. Yeah. from a Yeah, yeah. Got it. Um Jessica Rabbit. From a lab. Okay, yeah, maybe. Yeah, okay. Oh, it's got from it. Tangled. Oh, shit. <laughs> now you're just being mean. Uh, that was great, though. I was getting some awesome shots with that sniper. That was like the best round I've ever had. That was hilarious. <laughs> and, and then so this you, is the uh, one I'm not. You guys are going to think I'm weird on um, this one. You ready? Gl yeah. Gloria from Madagascar. Babs Bunny from Space <laughs> Jam. <laughs> <laughs> Babs Bunny. <laughs> Is that a real one or no? <laughs> I'm gonna go with no. The girl from Zootopia. <laughs> the girl from Zootopia. <laughs> I mean, why mess with what's what's working, you know? Don't fix what ain't broke. I'm kinda tempted to try and shoot her again even though she's on my team. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Yeah, I was taking hot shots from up here all last match. Oh, I got one of them. We're going to the ground on this one. No! Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. Buy one, get free. Buy one, get two free. <laughs> <laughs> get two free. <laughs> She's gonna get a point, we lost! This is ridiculous. <clears throat> Got him with that pop shot. Dang it. It's hard to shoot with the sniper when they're close. So 
somebody right in our base. That's a lot too. Uh, no! Oh, I'm killing everybody. Flag dropped. Red flag taken. Blue flag returned. Oh, I need a. I need. I need some inspiration. Hey. Need inspiration. <clears throat> like who? Like. <laughs> I think we're getting our butt kicked this time. Those two people talking seem like they've done this a few times. Blue flag taken. Blue flag returned. Blue team scores. Yes. Spray and pray with that paint gun, and it just kills everybody. So keep a gun in the other hand this time, so if someone gets up close... <laughs> oh, no. Red flag taken. How am I missing? Red flag dropped. Red flag taken. <laughs> yeah, we got completely Sweet crushed. <laughs> we got owned. That was not close. <laughs> no, that was not close at all. Can, can I draw attention, please, to the highest score on the map? Wow. I was gonna say it seems like it seems like everybody on the blue team has done this quite a few times. Uh, yeah. <laughs> well, I wanna be on you know, team. reach a certain yeah. age. <laughs> right. Yeah. Everybody wants to be on the blue team. Oh, yeah, I don't know. oh wait, that's. Oh, 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 oh. Did you come up with one yet, or what? Mario Kart, Daisy. Oh. Game on. Good choice. I think I got one more left. <laughs> yeah, I think this is my last round for tonight. <laughs> oh, oh, got me. But I don't know why she led me to death. <clears throat> Excuse me. I cannot aim very well. Man, they're all over our own base. What? They got like a pro team, dude. They're like esports players. <coughs> Excuse me. Team Sorry. Scores. I'm sure that's very annoying. It's extremely annoying to me, too. Yeah, hey, I finally killed somebody. Yay. Fun. I 
like we're never going to get their flag at all because nobody can even get a chance to get out of our own base. Whoa! <laughs> I believe that. We just snuck into their base successfully without anybody seeing. We're so good. No, five seconds till we die. <laughs> Red flag taken. Red flag dropped. Red flag returned. Blue flag dropped. <laughs> so what's your esports team name? Better get out those Coleman grills for all those campers. Got him. Red flag taken. Red flag dropped. Red flag taken. I just walked right into that one. Yeah. Red flag taken. Blue team scores. These are people who spend a lot of time in rec room. <laughs> I think so. I think yeah. right there. I'm thinking maybe there's a chance they have some sort of esports team or something because they're a little too good. It always makes me laugh how good people get at such casual games. Blue flag taken. Blue flag taken. Sakurion, hey, welcome to the stream, how are you? Hey, thanks for the raid, Prydak, thanks. VR, yeah, VR, of course VR. Oh, it was Nate, Nate Sheriff raided me, okay, thanks for the raid, Nate, appreciate it. How are you doing? Have you been playing more Among Us, is that where you came from? Among Us? Sorry guys, I didn't look at the chat for a while because I was so zoned in. Trying to get this dub, which we are certainly not getting. Uh, I got your back, man, let's go. Come on, I'll get your back. Come on. We gotta sneak out of here. Come on. Playing with Cryptic in his game. Nice. How'd that go? We just got here. This is a slow raid, it seems. Give me that grenade, man. I need it. Oh, I was looking at chat. You got it, dude. Tired. Doing nice. Nate raided, huh? Nice, nice. Yeah, for some reason, the alert didn't come over my speakers on my headset. So I just glanced over at chat and all of a sudden all kinds of new people are talking. Yep, that's it. Uh, I got voted three times for not being imposter. <laughs> nice, nice. I got imposter way too many times. A little sorry. You should be. It's so sorry, paintball. You're like a monster out there. We'll do another round. We'll do one more or two more, a couple more. Papa Champ, welcome to the uh, stream. How are you? Yeah, trying to stream some VR, so here's some background for everybody in the chat right now. Like, I used to stream VR all the time, like almost every night. And then for some reason, like, I don't know if it was some sort of uh, update that happened on either the VR software or if I screwed my computer up somehow, but all of a sudden the VR streaming just didn't work. So tonight's like my attempt to test it and try to get back into it after making a bunch of changes on my computer to try and improve the performance. And I'm not going to lie, when the stream first started, it went very badly. The test failed miserably. We were trying to play Half-Life Alex, and it froze within like five minutes. Crashed my whole computer. This game has been running a lot better, but it's still not as smooth as it used to be. So I'm not sure what happened. Being imposter is frightening. I probably need to keep playing, but I think it's fun to watch. How often do you stream VR? I used to stream all the time, like at least probably three days, three days a week. 
but like I said, my computer for some reason, I don't know what changed, but it started crashing anytime I tried to stream VR, so I stopped. So I'm working on getting my computer back to where it was. Whatever change happened that ruined it, I'm trying to fix. So this is my first night testing it, but once I actually get it working smoothly, I plan on playing VR like probably two or three nights a week again. Had to raid and bail. Hey, no problem, Nate. Thanks for stopping by, man. Glad to hear it. Among Us was a pretty fun time. What system is my VR on? PC. I got an Oculus Rift S. Um, I'm thinking about saving up to get a... Uh, <laughs> that was weird. Music. But I'm thinking about saving up to get one of the... Uh, Valve Index. Because they're like a thousand bucks. But I've heard people have way less problems with them than they do with the Oculus as far as streaming it and stuff. So just for the simple fact of wanting to stream, I might just have to save up and get that, because this thing is just not working very well lately. If anybody in chat right now streams VR or knows anybody who streams VR, I would love some tips on troubleshooting to try and figure out what this problem is, because I used to love playing VR all the time. Is it easy to stream VR? No. VR streaming is a huge headache. Like when I first got it working very well, I was surprised and like impressed with myself that I got it working now like it does not work at all it just crashes my system constantly because the vr game itself takes a lot of cpu like a lot of uh computer power and then like layering that on top of the streaming software like just crashes it constantly have a good night nate now that you say that nate same i can kill a few minutes here i have poor sleeping habits anyway yeah, I'm not gonna lie, when you guys raided, I was just about to get off anyway. That was gonna be my last round. <laughs> but then since you guys came in, I was like, oh, we can play a few more. But I do appreciate everybody stopping in. If you guys wanna follow uh, <laughs> the uh, VR streaming adventures of Bubby Ruski and all of the failures that are bound to come with it, feel free to follow. How was it at the beginning streaming VR? Like, well, that's the thing is it's different than a normal stream because you have to like, Technically, it works the exact same way. So if you stream Sicurion, um, like you have your video uh, output, your audio output, your audio input, it's all laid out the same way on the streaming software, except like obviously you have to manually change it. So my audio input right now is set to my Oculus mic, and then my video output is set to my Oculus headset. Or in the case of this game, this game actually displays the game on the computer screen so you can window capture it. So like as far as using the streaming software, it's not any different, but apparently the resources are very heavy when you're playing VR, so it doesn't have enough resources on my system anyway after you play the game to have enough left over to stream without it like crashing constantly on me. It didn't used to be that way. It used to be a completely smooth and seamless process for the most part. But I don't know if I got like a bug or a adware, spyware, virus, what, but all of a sudden my computer, anytime I play VR, the CPU usage is like 100%. There's nothing left overhead for the streaming software to use. And it didn't used to be like that. I never tracked the CPU usage before, but just from how well it worked before, I could tell you it wasn't like that. Like it, it had plenty of overhead to stream with the VR game. Is my headset wireless? No, the cords are behind me. <clears throat> You can make a, you can get a wireless headset. The Rift doesn't have an option for it, but like the HTC uh, Vive and all those headsets, like you can get wireless adapters for them. But then you're just making a very expensive hobby even more expensive <laughs> because the wireless adapters are like 200 bucks. Like this game is probably the smoothest experience I've had streaming a VR game in a long time. And that's not saying a lot, because this particular game, as you can probably tell by watching it, is not resource heavy at all. Like, this is pretty much just Roblox in VR is what it is, what it boils down to. Did I get him? I did not get him. Good shot, good shot. How many do you keep running in background now you didn't before? I don't. That's the thing is like I literally started my computer the other day with nothing on in the background. I shut off all the startup processes. I only opened what was necessary for the VR game and OBS. And the weirdest thing about it is like OBS can just be open on the computer. It doesn't even have to be actively recording or streaming. And it will make my VR gameplay like tank. Like it will crash constantly. When it is playing, the FPS just drops and plummets to the basement. 
and that's just from opening OBS. Like nothing, I don't even have to have a scene set up or anything. OBS just opens and all of a sudden my VR just crashes everywhere. But to give you an idea, like when you're in VR like this, you can actually press a button on the remote and you guys will still see the game, but I can actually see my desktop on my screen right now and I can move open windows around. I can open uh, software that's on my computer. I can even type Word documents if I really wanted to. But like, that's how I control the stream is like while I'm in here and playing, like there's a window over here that shows my desktop and that's how I'm reading chat. It shows my stream window and then to the right of that is my chat. And then underneath that is all my OBS settings, like my controls for my audio and my video and everything. But that's how you have to do it with VR is like you open the VR game first and then while you're in VR, you open up all the, uh, the software and everything reinstall OBS. I've reinstalled everything. I've reinstalled Steam and moved it to an NVMe SSD on my hard drive, or my motherboard. I reinstalled OBS and put it on the NVMe SSD on my motherboard. The only thing I haven't done yet is reinstalled Windows and put it on my NVMe. And that's like the next step I'm going to take, because everything I've done is not fixed at all. I'm about to score this W. I'm about to score this W. Wubba lubba dub dub! Red team scores. Dubbed it. Nice job, Bobby! Thank you! Woo. Open windows with a button. Uh, oh god! Is that Microsoft headset? It's a, that's all VR headsets. Like Oculus has a software built in called Oculus Dash that they put into their software where you hit the Oculus button on the remote and it like opens up your virtual desktop window in VR. And you can like do anything you would normally do on your desktop right from the VR headset. Obviously, I don't have a keyboard, so typing is really tedious. So I avoid anything that requires typing when I'm in a VR headset. But like you can move things around, you can drag and drop like a mouse, you can click on stuff, you can watch YouTube. Like a few times when I'm playing games off stream, I'll have a window open over here in the corner that has like a YouTube video or something playing, so I can watch somebody play YouTube, play games on YouTube while I'm playing games because I'm a big loser like that. <laughs> And everything in my life that I do in my free time is around video games in one way or another. Go, 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 Bubby. No! You got me. Feels like Inception. That's pretty much what it is. How is it like streaming standing? Your legs get tired after a while. Like, I streamed uh, Alien Isolation the whole game a little while ago, like that was the last game I successfully streamed in VR before my computer started acting funky. And uh, I played that one sitting down because I knew it was a long game and I was like, I'm not standing up, standing up for 30 hours worth of playing this game. But yeah, like right now I'm two, two and a half hours into the stream. My legs are starting to get a little tired now. Red flag taken. Blue flag returned. And some VR games require a lot more motion. Like this one's pretty much just like rotating your upper body and aiming your gun. There are some VR games I've played before, like Boneworks, where you actually have to like climb obstacles and you have to duck underneath obstacles and like actually move your body around. Whereas this game is pretty much you just stand still the entire time. What? Blue got three points? I thought we had three points. Oh, they did win. I thought we were tied. 30 hours, your legs would not last. No one's will, especially if you still work the next day. Unless you can call off, yeah. I'll do a couple more rounds. But yeah, I mean, I do plan on playing more VR games in on stream. Like, there's a lot of VR games coming out in the next couple months, actually. That's why I've been trying to get it back up and running the way it used to. Because Star Wars uh, Squadrons comes out in October, and that's going to be VR capable too. So I'm going to be playing that in VR on stream if I can get it working. Because that game is going to be super intense in VR. Playing in a little space fighter cockpit, shooting people in space. That's going to be super fun. Give me my gun, man. Game on. No, I dropped it. No. Capture the Any other VR games? I'm expecting uh, Squadron, Star Wars Squ Squadron is pretty much the only one, and that's actually kind of ironic because it's not even made as a VR game. It's just a regular console and PC game, but then the makers of the game decided to make it VR compatible. 
because a strange thing I don't really like too much about VR is there aren't games coming out very often. Like, a big VR game probably only comes out like once every six months. N tried FNAF VR? I have actually, yeah. I've played, uh, one of my viewers actually uh, donated a copy of FNAF VR to me. It's on the, uh, I have a YouTube page that has all of my uh, VODs, and you can watch FNAF on there. You can watch Alien Isolation, too. In my opinion, Alien Isolation was actually way scarier than FNAF was. Like, FNAF was a lot of jump scares at the beginning. Like, it really scared you, like, with the jump scares at the beginning. But then after a while, you just kind of got used to them, and they wore off. Whereas Alien Isolation in VR, it, like, never got any less scary from the beginning of the game all the way to the end. Alien Isolation was just scary as hell. Like, I literally felt a few times during Alien Isolation in VR that I was going to die. Like, I, I thought I was going to have a stroke or a heart attack. It was so scary. Getting chased by an alien in space while you're, in like, in the game. It's really creepy. So funny. It was pretty funny. I was scared, though. I was scared for my life. <laughs> hey, that's not very nice. The other thing about VR that kind of sucks is like it's really hard to drink while you're playing in VR. <laughs> so a lot of times after a couple hours of playing this game, your throat gets dry and like scratchy. And there's really not much you can do about it. Other than either just suck it up and keep going or like take a break and take the headset off and take a drink. Still like a niche sort of it's slow process, but one day they'll be as frequent as normal. Yeah, that's my dream is that like one day they'll have VR games coming out as frequently as regular games. Cause I've been playing, oh she's on my team, sorry. I've been playing VR since it first came out back in like 2014. And like it just, it still hasn't picked up pace to the point that I would like it to, but I'm hoping someday it will. Pokemon and Sword Art Online. Yeah, they've had a few MMO VR games come out. None of them have been really great so far, but I've heard rumors that there is actually a Sword Art Online VR game in the works by like a big publisher. I don't want to say any names because I don't remember for sure, but I want to, I believe it's like Koei Tecmo or something like that. <laughs> Problem is a long time ago. Goodness, that took a lot of shots. Good job, good job. A uh, VR Pokemon game would actually be really cool. There was a Pokemon type game that came out on Steam this past year. And for a while there, the makers of the game were discussing the possibility of making it VR, but I don't think they ever did. Or they might still be working on it, I don't know. Shoot the grenades, gosh dang it. If you can shoot the grenades, they'll blow up and it will kill everybody around. Temtem? Yeah, I thought I heard rumors that they were going to make it into VR. Or they were considering. I don't know how far that talk ever got, but... And still, I got it. Thanks. Go. There we go. Got the whole team. Thank you. Is it Tim Tim? <clears throat> I'll have to look it up. Like, I'm pretty sure I heard rumors that they were talking about making it VR compatible. Because, totally from what I understand, like, I once. Like, a lot of uh, indie games are made, like, on Unity Engine. And from what I. Wow, your shield is, like, blocking oh, everything. Wow, okay. <laughs> And uh, from what I understand, like Unity Engine, once you make the game, it's very, very easy. Well, not easy, but like relatively easy for the amount of work that's required to add VR compatibility to it. I still got to play my PC copy. I was only playing as a co-op, but I wish I could make more than one profile on Temtem. Oh, that sucks. I don't have like more than one save game. I never bought it. I was interested in it, and then I watched a bunch of people play it, and I was like, okay, well, I get the gist of this. I had to check what team I was on so I didn't start shooting that guy. Are you a streamer, Sakurion? Do you ever stream?
No! My gosh, how did he not hit me before that? I was literally just standing still. I should have went for the flag carrier first, but it, I was all muddled, muddied up. It didn't dawn on me that the flag carrier was right there. Flag they like constantly have somebody in our base just waiting for the flag to respawn so they can grab it. So just to warn you guys who are watching right now from Nate's stream, like I'm not very good. <laughs> Oh, no, I'm no my, I I'm never. My I watch a few oh, streamers like I'm Nate, though people have said I should, but I'm way too shy and nervous, even if it isn't with a mic. Even if it's a mic. Yeah, I considered streaming for a long time before I started doing it. Now, like, I'm not anywhere, like, near a big streamer or anything like that. I have, like, a regular following of about five or six people who watch, like, every stream, which is cool. Like, I appreciate that. But, like, I need to work on my computer a lot for streaming because a lot of times it just doesn't act the way I would like it to. Things aren't ever as smooth as I would like them to be. And it doesn't really make sense because I have, like, a 2070 graphics card and an i5-9600K. So, like, all things considered, I think that's a pretty high-level computer. So I don't really know why my computer struggles so much with streaming games. You're fine. I watch streams for fun. Or skill is not required so long it's all good fun. Yeah, that's kind of how I am too. Like, I'm not very good at any of the games I play. I just enjoy playing them. Now, back in the day when I was streaming regularly and playing Go VR like three times a week, I got pretty darn good at this game if I can say so myself. But it's been so long since I've played. This is the first time I've even played. Something's up with your PC. Yeah, that's what, I, what people keep telling me. They think I might have a virus or something. But like, I used to play VR all the time, and this is the first night I've tried playing VR in probably four months. So it's actually working relatively well in this game, but like I said earlier, this game requires nothing. Like, this game can run on a potato. This literally runs on an iOS, like Android phones. You can get this on a phone. Now the game I'm going to download next for VR is VR Chat, because apparently VR Chat actually has a version of Among Us inside of it, where you can play Among Us in VR. And I was watching a YouTube video of it earlier today, and it's in beta, like it's a mod that they're currently working on. But like, I was watching a YouTube video earlier today, it looks so hilarious, like I was cracking up so much watching people play that. Did you go into some strange site, open odd links, anything out of the usual? Uh, no, other than a version of Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild that may or may not be on the computer instead of the Switch. By the way, what's your stream rated E to your M? It's rated M. I just always put M because especially if I'm playing online, I never know what anybody's going to say or do. It's a broke outfit. Not just to avoid any language. No, you're good. You're good. Because, like, you can't, you can mute people in VR, but it's, like, a long, arduous process. So, like, whenever I play a game, I'm just like, eh, whatever. I can't, I can't be, I can't be held accountable for what people online say or do. Bubby is definitely 18 plus. Yeah, mostly because you chat. You guys are bringing up some stuff. Stuff I've never even heard of. Like, what's a rusty trombone? Who knows? Ready to start. You guys talk about it all the time, every night. Just double checking because I know I tend to slip up. Us? You? Don't act like you don't know what I'm talking about. Oh wait, I was just talking about being parched. Wait, don't start yet. Uh, I don't think this actually works, but it's a placebo effect. It feels so good. We're gonna win. We're gonna do it. We're doing it this time. We're doing it. That's my hey, COVID not real is on the red team. What is a rusty trombone? Wait, don't answer that. I don't think we want to know. I don't know. I've just heard chat talk about it all the time. I'm like, I can't be PG. Just doesn't sound like something that's PG. And I'm not off to a good start this match, I'll tell you. 
I'm curiously clueless. So like this is one of many games inside Rec Room because Rec Room is actually like it comes with pre-made games from the makers, but it's kind of like roadblocks, like Roblox. I keep saying roadblocks, but it's Roblox, where like people can actually make user-made content. So like if I open this up and just press play, like go to hot and like all of these are user-made games, like things that people made inside Rec Room, and you can go in there and play their games. It's pretty cool. Some of the games are really cool, like people make a lot of escape room games in this because it makes a lot of sense. But I like the, like this is my favorite game in all of it. Red flag dropped. Pretty much any time I play, I play this. No! Red team scores. Sounds like it says, but I'm curious how people really see it. Looks like paintball. That's pretty much what it is. Yeah, it's paintball capture the flag. We're gonna get crushed. The other team we've been playing with all night, they're like pretty much, they're like semi-professionals. <laughs> I don't know how often they play, but it's clear that they play very often. Yeah, see, the match only lasted like five minutes and they already got three three points. That was pretty quick. Semi? Yeah, maybe they're just straight up professional. I hate that stupid map. There's no way to go. There's no way to, there's no way to go in. The thing freaking caught in. Stupid. Stupid. You're a stupid bitch. Hey. Oh, by the way, man, I haven't even been paying attention. The alerts aren't coming over my headset. Kodo followed, Captain Howie followed, and Papa Chimp YouTube followed, or Papa Chimp Y2. I appreciate that, guys. Thank you very much. Appreciate the follows. For some reason, like, usually I have alerts turned on. Oh, that's why. So I forgot to turn the alerts on on the VR stream. <laughs> uh, Sakurion followed. Thank you. I appreciate that, guys. Thank you very much. I was looking at, like, my OBS, and I'm like, why is the alert not working? And then, yeah, there are no alerts on my VR stream. Okay, well, fair enough. Well, thanks for the follows, guys. I'm sorry I missed them. Game on. That was a fail. Capture the flag. We still love you. I hope so. My streams tend to be just a combination, a compilation of all kinds of uh, <laughs> technical difficulties, but... I try. I try my best. <laughs> You're fun. Thank you. I appreciate that. You're worth it. Don't follow folks much because streams get too intense and I follow for fun. I appreciate that. That means a lot. Thank you. Yeah, and you'll see each map has different weapons. So this map actually has mines and a paint gun. And the paint button gun, in my opinion, is like way OP. <laughs> so I hate when people use it. But the mines are pretty cool. Like, you can strap a mine to your body, so if someone shoots you and then, like, runs up to, like, I don't know, like, teabag you or something, then, like, the mine will blow up when they walk up to you. It's kind of cheap, but I think it's hilarious. Go, man, go! Nice. At least we got one good person on our team, apparently, because they're doing all the work. You guys missed it though, a couple matches before you guys got here. Like, I was. Sorry, Bobby. You're good. I was ruling with the sniper rifle up on top of that movie theater. I was like, I, I think I went 10 and 1 that match. It was insane. Blue team scores. Like, the sniper rifle feels so good in VR because you feel like you're, actual, you're actually aiming it manually and you're doing all the work. <laughs> like that. Oh, yeah! <laughs> Stay still. Oh, I almost had him. So basically, I'm not gonna say it and get flagged. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> help me! I'm what? Mario T, please help! help what the uh, rusty trombone? <laughs> There's no helping. I don't even know how I would help that guy. He's on his own. Oh, they also have a uh, battle royale mode. What you said about the bomb to the body? Oh yeah. That can be taken some pretty bad ways, I suppose, yeah. Red flag taken. I'm gonna die. Yep. 
They all like to hide behind stuff at their base, so as soon as it says red flag taken, they all pop out and start shooting at you. So if you die, they do too, yeah. They send one person out to get the flag, and then the rest of them always hide at the base. Wait for someone to steal the flag, and then they all raid them like ants. Ants on a picnic. So that's that paint gun I was telling you about that I think is super OP and should be taken out of the game. I mean, at this point, it doesn't really make any difference for me because these players are already crushing me. <laughs> Let me see if I can actually add alerts to the VR stream, so in the future, when I stream in the VR, I will know when an alerts happen. This sucks, all right? There's always get me up. Can someone shoot through here? Hey, you, over there, please. Hey, there. you, hey, please, God, no. Can someone shoot through here? Can someone get a red team to shoot through here so I die? Red team scores. Halo in VR? Uh, there's actually currently the person... So Alien Isolation isn't playable in VR by default. It's made with a mod. And the same guy who modded Alien Isolation to work in VR actually has a mod in the works right now to get Halo, Halo 2, and Halo 3 on the PC to work in VR. And if he ever actually finishes that mod, I'm playing all three of them. <laughs> like, that's going to be awesome. And the problem, like, not necessarily a problem, but the thing that I've noticed and I've asked other people I know who have VR is once you start playing VR games, like the only thing you ever think anytime you play any other game is, oh man, this game would be so much better if it was in VR. Like that's literally all you think about every time you play any game ever. Like the first thought that came to my mind the first time I played Among Us, I was like, man, this would be awesome if it was like in first person and in virtual reality. Don't shoot me. And that's why in VR chat, supposedly they have a first person VR mod that lets you play Among Us. And I'm actually very interested to try it out. <laughs> Drive a warthog or a ghost flying. There are flying games in VR. I had a few of them a while back. Uh, Elite Dangerous is one. You're in a spaceship and you actually fly through the real galaxy, like the real, real to life scaled one to one galaxy that we live in. You can actually fly from planet to planet and do missions and quests and trading. Dog fighting out in space. It's actually really cool. Nice suit, man. Looking slick. Driving a scorpion. By the way, how is Vertigo? So that's something I mentioned earlier in the stream. Um, and I've mentioned it a few times uh, in VR to people I know and friends that watch me play is like VR actually tricks your mind so well that you're here that like if you go up high or look from the base of a high building up to the top like you will experience the exact same vertigo feeling you, you feel in real life. Like if you like this isn't high enough. But there are places in this game that are high enough that if you climb up to the top and jump, like, you will feel like your stomach is flipping upside down like you do in real life if you fall from a high place. <laughs> Give me roller coaster VR. There is a first-person shooter game I play on here sometime, and I might play it on stream again if I can get it working once I get the VR stream Bye -bye. working again. It's called Pavlov. Okay, that's fine. And that Bye -bye. game is just user-made content. And one of the games somebody made was just like a massive skyscraper that you all fight on top of. And when you fall, you fall like 50 stories. And anytime I fall off of that level, I'm like, oh god. Like, <laughs> I have to close my eyes because I'm like, this is scary. Like, it's legitimately scary. And the immersion in VR is so good. That's one of my favorite things about it is like scary games that I usually play on the computer and the console don't scare me at all like I, I think they're really lame but then scary games in vr man i get so scared like i get to a point where some of them i have to stop playing because i'm like no like this is creeping me out so much because you're actually immersed in the world feeling like you're actually there so like anything that pops out around a corner with like a knife or anything to kill you like your mind and your body actually is tricked into thinking that thing is trying to kill you like it gets really creepy sometimes 
Oh yeah, I'm sort of a roller coaster junkie. I need my coaster adrenaline, but wooden coasters scare the crap out of me. It's old and shakes too much. I actually prefer the wooden coasters. I think it's a lot more adventurous. But it is interesting to think that most of them are over like 50 years old at this point. <laughs> so you're like, how often do they actually replace the wooden boards on these things? Or are they just the exact same boards and screws they were made with 50 years ago? Haha, suicide bomber! And there you go. There's a perfect example. <laughs> All steel coaster, no problem. Wooden coaster is almost life and death. So now I have alert box on my VR stream. So if anybody else follows, they'll be able to hear it. So I'm excited about that. I'm still feeling kind of bad. I missed all the other follows earlier because usually I'm on top of that stuff. But I literally just put all of this uh, OBS up today. So I must have just overlooked the alert box when I did it. They do have... I had to turn my volume down because it was getting like way too loud. Um, I don't know why, the music seems like it turned way up. They do have a roller coaster game for VR where like, again, it's user created content. So like people can go in and make their own <laughs> roller coasters and you can play them. But the downside to that is like every single person has like, I don't know if they're just trying to like oh, troll, but every single person who makes a roller coaster in that game just makes it as nauseating as possible. So like you choose any random roller coaster made by somebody in that game, it's like, oh, here's three loops. Here's 20 corkscrews. Good luck holding your lunch in after this. I want extreme. The one old roller coaster in Hershey Park was a slow coaster wise like that 20 miles per hour. But I was rattling through it and my mind said, yeah. There is one wooden roller coaster in a place I used to go at in Pennsylvania because I used to live up near there. And the roller coaster was so rickety that if you rode it, like, you would get a headache. Like, they tell you when you get on to, like, brace your head back against the headrest. Because if you let your head bounce around as you're riding it, like, you will literally get a headache. There's no preventing it. Because it rattles so much and then the turns are so sharp when you take them that your head is just getting whipped around everywhere. So, like, that I don't like. That's one part about roller coasters I can't stand when they make them, like, super super rickety on purpose and like thrash you around. I hate that. <laughs> Sounds safe. That's why you don't eat. <clears throat> Before you play the VR roller coaster game, of course not, yeah. No, 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 get it. No, kill them all. Come kill both of them. <clears throat> oh, they ran fast enough. I didn't get either one. Oh, I did get one. Okay. They must have ran back in too fast. Because the explosion bubble will stay there for a while. Got her. It's like the first kill I've gotten all around other than that accidental explosion kill I got just now. Man, some of these people aim so well. Nothing like some light head trauma. Yeah, it makes it more exciting, you know? And the funny thing is, you're paying for it. <laughs> you're like, oh, let me pay $75 to get admission into this place so I can leave with a headache and a stiff neck. I went to Universal some time ago, went on the Hulk. It was hype 30 seconds and got bored and two minute ride. <laughs> it's kind of like Space Mountain. If you've ever been to uh, Disney, like one of the big hyped rides in Disney is Space Mountain. It's like a super fast roller coaster through the dark. And like the line when we went took like four hours just to ride the ride. <clears throat> Excuse me. And the roller coaster is so fast that the ride is over in like 20 seconds. So I was like super hyped like the whole four hours I was in the line. I was like, yes, I've always wanted to ride this. I hear nothing but great things. Everybody says if you go to Disney and you only ride one ride, make it that ride. We waited in line for four hours. I was hyped, got on it. The thing shoots out like a bullet at the very beginning. Like it even says like brace yourself as a countdown and it shoots the car out of this tube like you're a bullet shooting out of a gun. Then like it's just that steady pace the entire ride through the dark and then like 20 seconds later it parks and you're done. And I was like, that was not worth it. 
<laughs> I immediately regretted riding it. I was like, I could have been doing something else this entire time. Like, I could have rode so many other rides in the four hours that I waited in line. Man, I'm such a bad aim. Yeah, definitely for four hours, yeah. Space Mountain board nearly instantly. So it wasn't just me, that's good. Honestly, like, you're gonna laugh if you've been to Disney and you've rode both of those rides. But, like, Space Mountain was disappointing to me. I loved the Br'er Rabbit ride. Like, the Br'er Rabbit ride was, like, nice and casual. Like, the little animatronics tell the story of Br'er Rabbit as you're, like, riding down a little casual river. And, like, at the end when he's thrown off the cliff into the Br'er Patch, your car you're on, just, like, your log just drops, like, plummets into a big waterfall. And, like, I thought that was way more enjoyable than Space Mountain. I thought it was hilarious because I wasn't expecting it. I was like, man, this is a really casual ride. Like, I can kick back and relax. Then at the very end, like, it gets pitch black and you don't know what's coming up. And all of a sudden, the door opens and it's just, like, 90 degree drop straight down into the water. I can't believe both of us missed each other so many times. <laughs> what's that? Oh, dear. No, I always go to It's a Small World. Oh, It's a Small World was kind of decent, too. It got old, though. Like, it rides way longer than it should. Like, if there was any way for them to just speed the ride up, like, twice the speed it is, the ride would be a lot better. Because by the time you're halfway through, it's like 10 minutes later, you're like, come on. We get it. It's the same song over and over again. The animatronics are cool to look at, though, because the rooms are literally just filled with animatronics everywhere. Is this an even game so far? No, we're getting our butts kicked like usual. <laughs> How, their whole team just passed me. Didn't even notice I was there, I guess. Grandma! Grandma got the flag! Grandma! Oh, I guess it's a guy with a gray hoodie. I thought it was gray hair. Now, the song is deadly. I wish to make it spoopy for Halloween, but this is Disney. I love the creepy pasta about it as well. I used to read the creepypasta stuff about stuff all the time. I love the one about uh, Pokemon. Like, how all of these Pokemon are, like, uh, that one got really creepy. Like, all the Pokemon are, like, slaves. And, like, there's, like, a haunted Pokemon graveyard somewhere in the game. And, like, I don't even remember. There were really creepy things about it. Okay, Bubby, I gotta get some sleep. Enjoy the rest of your stream. Yeah, I'm about to get off, honestly, after this round. It's probably the last one. But I enjoy you guys. Appreciate you guys stopping by. Thanks for coming around. Have a good night, Pradek. We might be playing Among Us tomorrow. I gotta figure out how many people we have to play. But a friend of mine who actually uh, donated the game to me hasn't had a chance to play yet, so he wants to play. Early Pokemon is dark, yeah. Nobody's, nobody's here. The map's empty. Am I the only one left? Oh, boy. I warned you guys I'm not good at this. I warned you. You were, you were given fair warning. If I can get the VR working well on streaming, there are a few other first-person shooters I'd love to play on here. One being Pavlov and one called Onward, where it's like literally a military simulator in VR. And you actually have a... You actually like go in with a patrol or a platoon of four other people into a map that's just filled with enemy NPCs, like big towns. And you pretty much just have to clear out the town. And that game's super fun. I've played it on stream before. And, like, we played for so long, because we played, like, five rounds, and each round's, like, an hour long. But that game's super cool, because, like, it's literally a simulation. Like, you get grenades, you get guns, you only get so many clips on your clip belt. And if you run out of ammo, you have to, like, pick up a gun from one of the dead bodies of the enemies you kill. Yeah, it's, like, a super fun game. You can actually lay down in real world, and it will make your character in the game lay prone with a sniper rifle. It's super fun. <laughs> 
But I think I'm done for tonight, guys. Thanks for joining the stream. Thanks for uh, playing Snowball. Thanks for playing. I enjoyed it. High five. Yeah. But if I can figure out why my computer is acting up, I'll make sure we uh, play some more VR more often. And Rec Room is a free game, by the way, anybody who's watching. So if you ever want to play with us, you can play on phone, you can play on the computer. Um, there's a few other VR games I'm looking at that you can actually play with me in the VR. You can actually, as the viewer, create jump scares in the game while I'm playing. So we're looking at that to try and play once I can get it all figured out and fixed. But in the meantime, thanks for joining. Thanks for all the followers I got tonight. Captain Howie, Kodo, Papa Champ, Sakorion. I appreciate it from everybody. And until next time, stay safe. Have a good one. And I'll see you later. Bye.